Oh, I've got him in anyway. Hey, <laughs> give it away. Hey, good evening, everyone, and welcome back again with another crazy show on the channel. PD's Football Life Show is back again. Oh, lots to talk about on tonight's show, of course. We'll always have a laugh on the show as well. And yes, it's what this show is all about. Of course, we'll discuss again the Manchester City. Uh, defeat last week, which some people are still really disgusted by it, obviously. Uh, we'll talk about England since it's the international break. Uh, more in UFC and Newcastle United news. Um, as well, your rant, chip us half an hour within the show. Let's see what you got up for tonight. So, that'll be interesting. Yep, as well. Followed by, you know what, with an hour. And, of course... Yes. Well, it's always a laugh on this show. Anyway, we'll just get another guest in. Hey! hey, hey. Look who this Hello. is. Bonjour. It's Rylan. Well, he's gone fresh tonight. Hey. Well, I was meant to be watching a rom-com, but Emily's oh, just God. watching the end of a programme, so I thought I'd jump on with you, lads. Hey, fair enough, Ian. Fair enough. Since, since you're only allowed, like, three... Wait a minute, why is that re Can you hear me twice? No, no, I can hear you fine. Yeah, you want. I'll come back on two six. Okay, no problem. Oh, wait a minute, minute. minute, that's better. I had you open in two windows. Oh. No, 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 yeah, no. Emily's watching the rest of the programme. And uh, oh, fair enough. Since, since Paul with his new glasses only allows you on like for like 10 seconds. Mm hmm. You know what I mean? Like, I thought, do you know, you'll let me on for ages to talk loads of shit until Emily's finished watching a programme. My mate, Pete. Hey. <laughs> yeah. Are you doing eight hey, chippers? How are you doing, mate? I am good, good. Uh, probably back on a Monday right. night. Um, I, 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 I'm glad somebody did. The rest of you looked absolutely paggered. So, as a, <laughs> um, but, I have, I've, I've just literally got in, so I haven't been able to get on pause. Like, I've been to my granddad's birthday, so I've been doing the same. So, oh, yeah, you love, love your granddad, don't you? Anyway, well, in you know, the thing, guys, if you enjoyed tonight's show, hit the thumbs up, <laughs> keep the more search results. And of course, please, if you're brand new to the channel, if you're not yet subscribed, hit that subscribe button free to do so. It does help me the channel grow as well. And hit that bell notification that will let you know whenever we are live or when a pre recorded show video takes place on the day as well. Feel free to donate if you'd like to do so. If you want to become a member for just an 99p, hit the draw button, it'll be put into the next prize draw as well. That gets done on this channel. And of course, if you want to get on tonight's show, the link is pinned in the live chat. So I'll see you in the green room and bring you on tonight's show as well. So we'll dive into a few comments. Come in. Good evening, Brian. Even a Pete, absolute embarrassment for our media that Kia had to do a video. I wish her a speedy recovery with her cancer treatment. Absolutely, yes. Hope she has a speedy recovery as well. Uh, good evening, Tom. Even and watching this was TDR finishers ready to rock, if you know what I mean. Oh, yes, we do know, Tom. The fact that Anfield are making 9.57 million for three back to back Taylor Swift concerts just to prove we need to move with the times and build a new stadium. Says well, not, Brian. How's that? Because Anfield's exactly the same. They've just simply extended it. They haven't built a new That's stadium. It. <laughs> it. Good evening, Tony. Hope you're well. Oh, oh no, not you lot, Mr. DB in the house. Oh, yeah, yes. How's the, oh, how's the Ryland teeth, Ian? Says Brian. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> anyway, let's, lovely. Let's kick into it then. Um, so from last Saturday, I mean, the uh, chippers, I mean, yours, I could still, you would, abs I, I can imagine how you were feeling after that. I expect we'll get beat, but there's a stages of the game where, yeah, you play a Man City, but. Some some of the stages were just the goals that were conceded were comical. We didn't have to work for them. For a side as good as that, two deflected goals where Dan Byrne and Joe Willock for the first one, one doesn't close them down, the other one just sticks a leg out hoping to block it. I mean, come on. And then Botman, well, we know he's injured now, but 
the f- no. uh, where was the power between the header? He literally heads it towards goal instead of away from goal. Mm-hmm. It's just it's, it was powder puff defending. It was something that you shouldn't be doing against Man City or anybody. It was soft. But if he jumps with his, if he jumps properly, yeah, that ball goes over the bar. Or if he heads it properly, it's fucking <laughs> it's nice. No, it's just jumping with your arms behind your back. Out. Oh. You're like a like fucking silly salmon or whatever the fucking you know what I mean like you know do you know that like eh, 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 like you know <laughs> jump bang edit I don't see why you have to have your arms behind your back that's not natural arms in front no. of you bang you know but we'll not have a go at Botman I just I just think you know what it was a missed opportunity because they weren't at it. They weren't fully out. They, you could tell they were. Yeah, but but, but Chippers, if 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 we'd have been more at it, I think they'd have just been more at well, it as well. I, I know, I know they would have. It would, you know what I mean? It's just, yeah, I know what you mean, but it just it feels like it was an opportunity missed rather than you know. I, mm-hmm. I'm not. Do you know I what I see? What, do you know what I see? The last. In fact, I'm going to go as far as to say, every game since Aston Villa. If you look at every single goal, and I might be wrong here, then someone pull us up, and I'm, and in all honesty, I won't give a fuck. But someone pull us up. But it feels to me like every goal since we beat Aston Villa that we've conceded has been conceded because we have been shite. Yep. Yep. Teams have not played well against Chelsea. At Chelsea, the three goals we conceded were not because they were good. They were fucking wank. I was there. I was watching it. People go, oh, yeah, we got played off the pitch. Listen, I was there. We didn't get played off the pitch, right? We were actually the better team. For me, we were the better team in the certainly the first half. When they went ahead, it was completely against the run of play, right? And that's, that's my eyes. I've got to admit, usually I watch the games back. The last... Three games I've not been able to watch back. I've just thought, you know, it is. I'm not going to put myself through that. It's been that shit. So I've been there and, and it, like, but but we, every goal we're conceding is through mistakes, through people not closing down properly, through people yeah. passing the ball to, you know, like, like Botman just passing the ball straight to their fucking players, which, you know, this doesn't happen. And then you, but then, you know, you look at it and you say, I've said for months, and I, I don't know whether you know people, fucking, you know, e- even, even Chippers will back us up. And how long have I been saying <laughs> that he's not fit? Six not fit months, at all. Months and months and months and months, he's not fit. Same with Longstaff, he's not fit. I've said there's something up with him, whether yep. it's, Physical or mental, there's something up with him. Yep, and and it, and it has, and it's turned out that they're not fit. And they're not at all. Unfortunately, you can protect young players as much as you want, and I love Eddie Howe, and I am the last person to say, like Eddie Howe, I want Eddie to stay because I know that next season will be if, if he gets back. Next season's a different kettle of fish, but 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 you can't be playing. Longstaff when he's that ineffectual because Longstaff isn't a great footballer, but he hit no. he what he does is he does what Longstaff does when he's fit. He covers a lot of ground, he gets his foot in, he can play a decent pass, and on a, on occasion he'll get on the end of a, a he'll get on the end of a, a pass and he'll score a goal on the odd occasion. But not like this. You know. It's it's sad, but it is what it is. I, I, I also from think... uh, from uh, Brian. <laughs> Look at them, what you, Ian? Look at them, hey, white. I also think we can't have Dan <laughs> Byrne and Jacob Murphy's wing backs. I'm sorry, no. like, but you Dan just Byrne can't play wing back. But that's I mean... down to the management, Ian. I've been saying it for months. Yes, we've had injuries, but how was totally mismanaged the squad? The season, I will see that we need a massive overhaul. I don't think all season. I think, I think that 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 was that was the right. It was actually the right. He made the right decision on on. He actually made the right decision to play three at the back. He just played five at the back. Mm-hmm. 
He would have played three at the back season, with two wing backs. I think this season has shown Eddie Howe has, has, has been proved that he's not managed at the highest level. It's been proven it with the mistakes he's making. Um, you look at all the the, the top level managers; they don't make these mistakes because they they're used to this. Eddie Howe wasn't used to this game. That's where I'll stick up from for a bit. He hasn't been used to playing three games a week in his career. He's used to playing one game. But look where we are. Look where we are in the league. Mm -hmm. I know. And look, but look at the injuries we've had. And look where Chelsea are. Yeah. Chelsea have got a, a manager who's just gone from what PSG and fucking. You know what I mean? Let's be honest. Eddie Howe has had the worst. The worst luck. We've had the worst draws in every cup. We've had the. We've had the worst injuries. You know. That you could imagine. Eddie Howe has brought us back from a shower of shit, a, a pathetic football team who did not fight and did not try. And this season has been slightly disappointing. But we're still going to end up top half, whether we get Europe or not. We will. Mm -hmm. Look at our, look at the games we've got to run in. I still think we'll finish seventh or eighth. I might be wrong, right? But come on, look, look, and, and, and I know people go, oh, but we can't keep looking back. Yeah, we can't, but fuck me. They didn't back him up in January. Me, you, Pete, fucking everyone with eyes, anyone who knew Newcastle knew what we needed then. <laughs> and he didn't get a single player. Now, that's how, it's one of two things. It's either FFP stops us, which I hope it was, or... They didn't want to back Eddie. If they don't want to back him, and they're not going to back him because they don't have faith in him, then fucking, you know, get rid of him. But I don't believe that. And I think we've got money to spend coming up with the new sponsorship deals. We give him some, we give him five or six new players. Um, and we've also, remember, we've also got a couple of players that are already with us who basically haven't played who have now been trained to the Eddie Howe standards. You know, like, to, for me, Hall, when he when he came on, that first, do you know that touch that he, that touch that he made? Mm -hmm. Do you know what I'm talking about? When he took the ball yeah. with that touch, and I was like, fucking hell, he's class. Eddie Howe must look at that and must say, come on. But I, I, I do get it's, it's it's you know he's trusting in he's trusting in the players that he that he had that did it for him last season. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and, uh, absolutely. And I, I get where you're coming from, Chippers. But we need to give for me. We have to give him another season. I think it would be a disgrace if we don't. In, in all honesty. Even Pete Chippers and Ian all how are you all keep on good evening. Lee Fax Chippers, look you look at the injuries. I was talking to a Bournemouth fan who said he runs players in the ground. But the thing is, I was I haven't I haven't got my point across. That's what I'm seeing. I'm saying I'm trying to look at it. I'm sitting on the fence at the mix. I'm trying to look at both sides of the argument here because there's two sides to it. Yes. There's I'll defend how in certain stages because I think in January we should have signed players. And personally, I think the Dan Asher situation affected us signing players because I think they didn't know who to back. They didn't know whether to back him or back out. Yep. That's my opinion. And I think it's quite Correct. clear now that personally, yep. I, think the, I think personally they've backed the wrong horse. I think they backed Ashworth and obviously he's bugged off. Um, yep. I also don't think Eddie Howard times picks the wrong team. I think he did pick five at the back, which is the right thing to do. But Dan, I'm sorry, but Dan right system, wrong players. Team, yeah, Jacob Murphy shouldn't have been playing as a wing, wing back. Dan mm -hmm. Burns shouldn't have been playing as a right left back. Sean Longstaff shouldn't have been anywhere near our football field with his injury. So that's why how has to take criticism because that for me was wrong. Um, that, Did he think that, Murphy like, was that bad? I, I don't think he was bad. He's just not a right wing back when you've got Emil Kraft on the bad. bench. Yeah, I thought he did all right. You've got Emil okay. Kraft, who's a specialist in that position, that can play there. You know, yeah, that's, that's what I would mean. Yeah, I thought, I thought he did you all right. You should have got uh, Garassi and was the right price for 15. I think he would have been a good buy. Well, should have, but it's gone now. We've got scared. <laughs> and, right, Botman going off, and now we've heard the news, he's out for six to nine months. Perfect, man. 
The fact is, he should have had this surgery a long time ago. September. Wouldn't have minded. Yeah, look at it. Yeah, that's a question. I would have minded Botman sitting out for a while longer if he long he had this operation. Who's to blame? That's the question I want asked ask, answered because if I was well, Botman said, said he well, didn't want the surgery. Now Botman's well, been a bit that, silly. He? He's well, going Botman's to say that, a bit isn't silly he? there. Yeah. He's not going to the say medicals. all the yeah, he's not going to say the medical staff will not have an operation Botman, because then Botman, Botman didn't want the surgery because he wanted to play in the Euros. Well, but but mm. Botman's been a bit silly there. Or oh, the medical staff should have pushed him and said, sorry, no, that knee is not right. Yeah, Gavin, the surgery. Yeah, correct. This, this I, think where, that, I think yeah. that's that I think that might be why, you know, the, the physio that went, the head physio that went. Yeah, I'm good. That's a real kick in the teeth that he's he left us. He was one this of is the where ones, right? one of them should have had the balls to stand up and say, "Listen, Sven, we know you want to play, but you need the like operation you need, for your career. You need the operation for, the benefit for your, your safety. Because at the end of the day, now he could be yeah behind in development when he comes back. It, how how much pace could he have lost? He could have lost a lot of things that he had last go. season. Now he, he he might be a couple, he might have two or three yards of pace gone because of this. He might yeah, not his knee might not develop. There's so many questions that need answering, and to me, this is where PIF will look at the summer and go, Eddie, who's at fault for that? Was it you, or was it the medical team? Because they will have a debrief on it, because we spent money last season on him, big money for him, and now he's out, yeah, for the, he's out for nine months maximum. I think he'd be out longer because of the injury it is. Um, well, yeah, yeah it's, it's a 12 month injury, isn't it? Yeah. Will PAF give them another season or they'll get rid of Howe with the click of their fingers? See, PAF will not be frightened to pull the trigger any time on Andy Howe. Well, that's it. It's not our opinion. We can just have an opinion. It's not, their de- it's not our decision, is it? Yeah. <laughs> Unfortunately. No. That's I think, well, well, for me, they either have to back him properly this summer with the money that we're getting him from the sponsorships or get rid of him. No, I don't want to get, I don't want to get rid of him but 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 okay. there's no point keeping him there and not backing him. That's mm-hmm. just that's just slowing shit down again. Oh look who's here! Good evening, you fine specimens. And oh then. look who else is here! Good evening, lads. I will join soon. Our chat. The hey, one thing so. I look at as well, right? Um, this summer could have a, a lot of good caliber managers out of work. This summer, you're looking at. I know I said Klopp and people are going to laugh at that, but he's going to be at work and you've got Klopp it, out of work. And now he's not going to come, but you've got to listen to what I'm going to say to, to understand what I'm going to say. Go ahead. Mourinho is going to be possibly be out of work. They're going to look at these managers and think, ooh, short term. I know it probably won't happen, but if they want something in a couple of years, they might look at Mourinho and go, well, for two years, you get you in the team than Mourinho. Mm-hmm. Well, I, I don't know. I mean, I've won the treble with Newcastle on football manager when we had Chiro and Owen striker. So, I mean, I've got a chance of winning things. But um, <laughs> exactly. but the, the, this is what I'm looking at, though, is what are they thinking? What's their prerogative? Because we don't hear anything from them at the minute. <coughs> We've not heard them mm-hmm. come out at the minute and say, Eddie's the man to take with forward. They may have said short term, mm-hmm. but they haven't said long term what the vision is. Yeah, and this is where it. stuff like, they've got like the what you call it set up, like the is it the fans of the Azons or whatever? We've heard nothing from them. Mm-hmm. What's the point mm-hmm. of them? They're supposed to be communicating to us as fans. And we've heard nothing from them. No, that's um, it, exactly. This is where I'm a bit... I want... Like, what's the clarity? I mean, for me, there's silence. And there's too much silence. And, yeah. you know, it's it's definite at the minute that nothing's coming out of the club to say, oh, we're backing Eddie, or we're backing this person, or what, or what, or what. But... And like I said, I'm on the fence with how because I've got two sides to it. Like I've pointed there mm-hmm. why people disagree with us, fine, I don't care, but it's just my opinion. Like everyone's got one, like an arsehole, everyone's got one. Um That's it, yeah. But again, like I've just said, what's who like there's there's going to there's obviously gotta be something going down in the summer, i.e. a meeting or there's got to be the, the long term vision. Because after this season I would have accepted this season as last season where we finished 11th the season before, then we progressed to a top 10 finish, then we'll get yeah. fourth. That's the natural progression. 
mm-hmm. but we're like a hot mark now at the minute. <coughs> We've gone up from like that, and then we're back down again. So yeah, I yeah. I don't know. I think the FFP situation in January was a cover up personally, uh, because mm. the back the, the back they were going to give Ashworth money and he bugged off. So that was Fair my enough, opinion yeah. anyway. Could be in the statement they said the LEIs the with medical experts. I'll say the clubs is wrongled. You. Yeah. Uh, yeah, but, but, you know. Also in Botman's statement, he said others said that I shouldn't have surgery. Well, who are these other people? Yeah, that's it. Name them these because are? they're the reason why you're having surgery now because you didn't have it three or four months ago. Actually, yep. was it six months ago when you should have? Botman should have been overruled now that he's torn his ACL after surgery. You lose pace of being there. You literally have to back your knee up, says Brian. Absolutely. New Archer would pop as soon as I joined. We're not getting back together. <laughs> oh, jeez. And because Botman has been playing on it, they'll scrap all that torn cartilage in the ACL and drain all the fluid. Yeah, you would message me that, uh, Brian, as well. So, But Lascelles, it's his ch- I would say give him that chance to see if he's earned that new contract for next season. Because I think Lascelles hasn't really put a foot wrong this season. He'll not get a better chance to, but I still personally think that I would have got let him go and, you know, he's not getting any younger. It's what's role is he going to play well, next season it. at the club? Because apparently is he going to be... at... Yeah. Because we're looking at Lloyd Kelly next season, apparently. Yeah. Well, I, I would take him because he's, 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 he's got age on his side. Um, and he's a free transfer. Um, but we'll probably hey, dumbest going at... in the summer, isn't he? Well, yeah, but he's looking at probably the players. Player. players. I'm thinking, come on, do we need yeah. to be looking at those kind of players like Kelly, like Billing? Well, I think not. I think Billings would have been a, just a short term one, but I think Kelly kind of makes sense because he's a free and he's he's an international, so it kind of makes sense for that one. But I, I think Philip Billing may have been a if we're signing him on January, maybe for him for a couple of years, just as like a cut, like as a gap, stop gap. Um, yep. as a squad player, I, I think for me, he's too much a bit short, long, stappy. I think honestly, we need a bit better. Um, that, and the fact is, we've got money, but yep. you know, like people yeah. know we're going to have money to spend in the summer, so a Bournemouth yep. going to outprice one player like him. And if we went for someone like a Solanke for a striker or Hello. Good evening, everyone. Says Julie. Hope you're well. If we lose against West Ham, the pressure will increase. It certainly will do. It really, really will do. Because that's a game we should be looking to try and win that game, and it's not going to be an easy game of all. We have to. We're at home. We're yeah. at home. Similar, isn't it? We've got we ten cup finals. Kelly isn't that good? Says Ronald. Now, ready for Southgate ball tomorrow, lads. Oh. You're not doing the watch along, are you? With the net? No, no. Thank I'm God for that. Well, I might. Burr is yeah. right. Southgate shite. Burr is right. Southgate so shite. I might just look to see how Anthony Gorn does. Pretty much, that's it. But I don't think he'll start I made that up and I put it on to review and, it, and oh, no one even oh. chanted it. Burr is right. Southgate shite. I thought that was fucking mint. <laughs> Obviously not. <laughs> <laughs> of all the lads <laughs> going in with us, you know. My, Don't be singing Emily, that, or you gotta be singing that on Monday Emily, night. My Emily, anyway, is well. You you never start a chant unless you've got five or six of your mates who are going to join in with you. You know what I mean? I'm like, not joining in. Uh, what what Emily, are we drinking the night? What are we drinking the night in? What is that? Is that water. Well, white wine, oh. spritz. Huh? White wine. Oh, oh, are we being a oh, bit popular? Spritz. Oh, so white so wine, so well, so white so wine, so wine, so wine and lemonade. Oh, time for a new another guest. It is the man. It's Mister John Sin. Oh, hey! 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 what's going on here? James Bond. <laughs> Fucking James Bond. <laughs> Smooth Did criminal. Like that, oh. Did you like that, Johnny? Oh, I loved it, man. Thanks to you for oh, your support, would. man. I need to do some training, I think, and um. Because I want to look right to go to um um go to America. If we pre-season friendly next season, probably in July, because apparently you could be going to America. Hey, everyone. Hey, well, so, we got to Australia. Oh, I should have done, but starting my new job and I'm not going to get the chance to get that time off me. It's so 
I'm got it. But um, you know what, Sam? It's good to see you again, my guy. That's been a while. It has been a busy bee. I know. I'm on, on three now, and um, you know, it's well documented. It's been a cunty well. cunt. <laughs> I will not do the two chat after Cleveland inquiry, says Ronald. <laughs> it's been idea. a good idea. I, follow good idea. Um, I don't think you were seeing it. I don't think Billy will be on tonight because he wasn't on TDR the night. He's not feeling we'll well. No. He won't be. So, so uh, get well soon, Billy. No. I mean, I've been on this on Paul's channel. It's great to see Paul again. Like, I mean, he looks well as usual. No, and, good, um, and I won the competition as well. Well done. Yes, well done. Ah, you did. Yeah. Well, just just to I... say, just to say, two top guesses there, John. I thought I knew the answers to seven out of eight of the questions, and I only didn't know the answer to one of them. And you got all was, put us off. You got was it Simpson, Rob? <laughs> I was, that surprised, all I, was surprised. I was surprised you got it wrong, man. Because um, yeah, well, that Tony was coming off. on. Yeah, Tony will probably come on soon if uh, he's just maybe doing something at the moment. That all put us yeah. off, didn't he? You know so... what I mean? I'm a, I'm a, I am encyclopedia. You know what I mean? <laughs> See you on the first question. Bang. There. Done. Anyway. Uh, and Brian says, I'm glad we're getting TV studios and sound stage built in the northeast. I've got some ideas. Oh, interesting, Brian. What? What's free? What? We're getting built in the northeast. Okay, you know, Brian does a lot of that. I went on the quiz where um, they get, he gave the question on how many goals did Colin Veach score for Newcastle. I went 55, <laughs> the highest possible one. And um, the answer was actually 49. Oh, so close. Yeah, it probably was a guess. I'm guessing, though, was it? Yeah, yeah, but I knew he's such a great goal scorer, but um, so I just went for the highest one possible. Don't anyway, you worry, Lawrence. Lawrence. Don't you worry. Mm. Anyway, Lawrence, um, I've not had a chance to talk about that Manchester City game, so <clears throat> how are you feeling after Saturday? Well, we were expecting to get beat, but I'm a bit. I was. I think you got a question already going, well, more for playing Dan Byrne at um, left wing back. I mean, I know, I know that's not the whole reason why we um, lost the game. By the way, Scotland uh, have just gone 1-0 down against Holland. Um, but, um, oh, I'm surprised. <laughs> that's a know, it was just frustrating the two goals we could see in the first half from Bernardo Silva. We did better in the second half, but then I just remember the moment when, um, I mean, to be fair, in the first half, Isaac had a good chance to score. Hmm. I mean, it was a good save from Ortega, but Dan Byrne, I don't know what he's doing. He gets in the area, think, have a shot. He just tries to just play it to Willock. And I mean, I know he's not a left wing back, but you know, just have a go, mate. That's it. Um, but um, in my opinion, the international break, it's coming at a good time for us. People saying, hmm. you know, season's over, but we beat West Ham, which is I'd say probably more important than last week's game, then we're only going to be a point behind them with a game in hand and, of course, better goal difference. Yeah, um, that's it. But um, I think that West Ham game is definitely a bigger one now after the last couple of games. And uh, also, not to mention, it might help that Wolves and Brighton have got uh, quite uh, hard fixtures next weekend as well. Oh, well, there you are then. I know we're going to have to take advantage, but that yeah. might help. Uh, good evening, good evening, well, coffee. Mm -hmm. uh, Julie, work with a coffee. Unfortunately, they're built in Mackham Land once again. Once Biker Golf get productions off the ground <laughs> with full well 73. Oh, I heard something about that. Mm, yeah, I think I, yes, yeah, I did as well. So, well, then, yeah, it is what it is. And, yep, yeah. so, yeah, anyway, we're coming up to half an hour of the show. So, what? What was that? It was having a rave, I think. Right, half an hour gone. You know, I don't know. It is. You know what that means? It's time for. Come on, then. What are we getting off our chest Ooh. tonight, then, man? Uh, what am I getting off my chest today? Ooh. I'm gonna have a bit of a rant at England this weekend. Oh, okay. Cool. And Gareth Southgate, of course, because it's standard. Um, okay, go on then. No offence. 
but why is he picking the players that we know what can what they can do? Why is he not picking players like sort of more Anthony Gorns that need a chance to show what they can do in a national level? No mm-hmm. offense. The likes of Harry Kane and that who are in this squad, we know what they can do. We know what we know they can do at the tournaments. Players like Gorn are the players that need to be playing in these two games. Because ultimately, these are the players we're going to possibly depend on in tournaments for backup purposes like injuries and suspensions. And yet, they're not going to get a go. Sorry, they're not going to go to a tournament without any international experience under their belt. It's, no. These are the games are perfect for them. Yet, he's still well, no, he's going to play people like John fucking Henderson. Who? Why is he in the squad? He may as well have me granddad in the squad. He's it's ridiculous. Why? I'm sorry, but <laughs> well, why? Well, no offense, we're playing two home games. We're not playing away right. from home. We're, we're one of the favorites for this tournament, for Christ's sake. And he's going to be playing right. negative football. You just know he's going to play two holder midfielders. You just know he's going to play Harry Kane. You just you know what his team's going to be. You may as well, you may as well say, "Oh, I and I can name the I can name England team tomorrow." You're not going to be pick for the Nets. You're going to have Harry fucking Maguire at centre half. You're going to have. Possibly John Stones if he's fit to that centre half. Trippy has not fit, so he can't play left back. So he's, he's going to have that Palace ball probably. Right back will probably be Trent if he's in. Midfield will be Henderson, Bellingham, and another. But we know it's not going to possibly be Trent actually in the midfield. Then he'll play Gordon. another right back. He, he's not going to play Gordon as he come on. He's just called them up wow. for the sake of it. I think you'll have him on the bench and bring him on for twenty minutes, something like daft mm. like that. Then you now front it's going to be Kane. It's possibly is still in probably still is still in the squad. I don't know. I don't, know. I don't think he is. I don't think he is. You know, you're pretty right. much up. You're fucking shite. Southgate's right. You're fucking shite. Uh, so, yeah. I've pretty much named the team there tomorrow. And I just think, you know what, man? Where well, am I, Southgate? It's the two games before the European Championships. And again, you want to pick players that will know what they can do. Pick players that don't know what they, that we don't know what they can do. Because then these are the players that you're going to end up depending on, and yet again, like the last, like the World Cup, the last Euros, which you did exactly the same. You had two prep games to to get the team sorted for these tournaments, and you stuck. Imagine with the same this, though, Chippers. Imagine this, right? Imagine this. I well, know then. it's going to take a lot of imagination, but I know you've got a really good and imagination. A lot of, gl- of gloom different as well. I know. I know. I know you've got a really good imagination. And, yeah. so does, and, and, and so does he, Ranny Granny. You know what I mean? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> right. So, and, and Julie J as well. You know what I mean? She's, uh... Yeah. No, no. Hey, hey, Julie J. She likes us. Um, there you go. Well, so sorry, hey. I did, no, sorry, I just started to nip off because my wife's got like proper, actually, she's proper ill. All she's right, got, like so... fucking oh, chest, like infection. She's on antibiotics, so I've just been away and like the best husband in the world, which I am. Mm. I've I've made her a lemon, and uh, and an expensive honey drink. So I just oh. want to say that, so all the ladies can go. Oh, what a fucking top husband Ian is. <laughs> no <way. laughs> And everyone else can fuck right off. <laughs> no, anyway. Sorry. <laughs> sorry, what was I saying, Chippers? I forgot what I was saying. No, you were, uh, yeah. you were saying, I, Chippers. I'm on, I'm on, you were saying you had some sort of imagination or something. You had some sort of thing. No, you've got to, no, no, yes, yeah. Imagine. I've got this feeling, right? And I fucking know it's mad, right? But I've got a feeling that he might just actually try some new players tomorrow. Do you know oh, why? Damn it. No, no, listen. It's that drink listen. you're having. It's that drink you've got. Listen. Well, I know. Well, you know, you know, and I know that I battle with the demon. You know. You know, and maybe it's affecting my thoughts. But, but, I think that maybe Southgate will think we're playing. We're, we're playing Brazil, right? We're going to get smashed by Brazil. Why don't I play all the players that they want us to play, right? Because we play in Brazil, and then when and, they, and no, listen, listen, listen to me out. 
I'll, he'll play the team that he doesn't want to play because he thinks that then, if we get smashed by Brazil, mm -hmm. we can then go on and play the team he want, does want to play, which is full of the mm -hmm. geriatric fucking Hendersons and shit like that. I know it's weird, but he might just think, fucking throw a dice and let him in. And I actually think, when you look at Brazil one by one against us, yeah, they've got, I think they've got probably three or four world-class players, which includes Bruno. But I think we've probably got three or four world-class players ourselves. Yeah. Mm -hmm. and, Anybody else confused? And, <laughs> and I think if he sticks Anthony Gordon on that pitch, I, I might be fucking deluded here, but I'll tell you what, I would put Anthony Gordon at the moment up against any fucker. Anyone. Interesting. Interesting because one. I'll then. tell you why. Mm. Do you know what? Do you know what? I have never seen, and I f I'll be honest with you, I fucking hate scousers. Right. I'm from the northwest of England, that's where I was brought, brought up. I managed to escape that shithole like when I was like 19 and then got, got up to the northeast. You know, like I would not move back to where I'm from if they paved the fucking pavements in gold. It's a shithole. I wasn't from Liverpool. Where I'm from, yeah. shit. But Liverpool, you know, like honestly, I've I've got I've had more kickings off scousers, and I'm not even going to go into other things. Like, <laughs> oh, I know. Oh, no, no, they fucking stab you and all sorts. They are fucking nasty bastards. So I don't like them. I don't really like them. I'll be honest with you. But when Andy Gordon signed for us, mm -hmm. I was like, I didn't want it. And even my Tommy, Tom, you know, like, John, you know Tommy. Like, fucking Pete, you know Tommy. Yeah, yeah. Tommy's mm -hmm. like, I don't want him, I don't want him, I don't want him. Within two or three weeks, Tommy was like, I love him. Oh. He, yeah. and, and, and he's grown as a, as a man, as a player, as a human being, as everything. And you know that fucking interview he did when he like his in England interview yeah I looked at that and I thought fuck me I'm pre that he encompasses everything I want to play for Newcastle United even if he is a fucking yeah. scouser yep. which I know yep. it's hard to take mm. he he honestly he, he you know he, he wasn't good enough when he first came to us he went away, he tried harder, and he did, yep. and that's what he did. And and if every player that plays for us is as committed and has as big a fucking bollocks as, as Anthony Gordon, mm -hmm. we will we will do really well. And Hopefully. so if they play anyhow, if fucking wanky Nobison, the Middlesbrough fucking pubeless fucking ball bollockless, you know, like shit out. You know, like decides to actually play him tomorrow, thinking, "Oh, I know what? I'll play him against Brazil, and he'll do fuck all." Do you know what he'll do? I think mm -hmm. he'll run him fucking ragged. You know oh, what I mean? Interesting, like, interesting, interesting. Very. Newcastle. And if I'm wrong, and if I'm wrong, if I'm wrong, Pete, if mm -hmm. I'm wrong, he's obviously injured. Yeah. Mm. Too. Good evening, Louis. Hope you're well. Do all it is all right. right. I'll mean, argue with Chip has as well. Big up to Louis, by the way. Um, I'll, I'll argue with you with Chip has as well. I mean, South Gear is not going to change anyone at all whatsoever. He picks his favorites every single time. It doesn't offer us right. anything different, right? I mean, you could have chose Ross Barkley. He's having a fantastic season. Yeah, even like, Ronald season as well. <laughs> and look, exactly. Also, James Ward Prowse. What does this guy have to do to get into the England side? You know, yeah. he'll never be in the England side, will he? No, he won't. No, he never, never, never will be, but he never will. Because Gav yeah. Southern loves um, Henderson, yes, right? But then again, right, I mean, I've, we got the best, we got the best English striker in Germany, Harry Kinn, the best English player in Spain, Jude Bellingham, and the best young player in the Premier League, Bill Forden, yeah? All winners, right? And I tell you what, right, I think these guys, if Southgate gets it right, gets the tactics right, and stick to a 4-2-3-1 or a 4-3-3 system, he can play 4 3 3. I don't want to see him. No, play it's 4 2 3. It's, it's, he's got to play one defensive midfielder. 
Yeah, yeah, and that's, that, that's Declan, Declan Rice. Rice for me. Declan Rice for me, I think. So. Apart a, a a a with, a part four with four one, and then whatever you fucking yeah. want him from here. Yeah. yeah, because Rice can fucking cover every fucker. Well, you right? can do. He can do. He can, but we've seen him do it against us. He's quality, man. You know. I say. Just... Go on. Go on. No, you yeah. go. I was going to say, right? I mean, yeah, you're right. I mean, Declan Rice. I mean. And Roger, the best CDMs in the country, right? Let's be real, right? But Declan Rice, all right, like Ian said, you need one defensive mid, play him alongside Bellingham in a CDM, maybe. So, you know what I mean? Let Bellingham go forward. Declan protects the, protects the back four. Then Jude does what you want to do. Play a 4-2-3-1, right? That's mm -hmm. our best formation for England, I think, right? And keep it to that system, yeah? Yep. Gareth, Definitely. please don't change it up, mate. Still to 4 yeah. 2 three, one. That's our best formation. Yeah, if absolutely. you change the tactics, we're back three against the top clean teams like France, Germany, Spain. We're gonna get beat. It's yeah, not absolutely. even about the you know what it is, it's not even about the formation because we're all so busy wanking over fucking fucking what like you, you know, like football manager, right? I've played it for years and it's all like about formation. It's not about formation, it's about what people do. But as we I... can play four, we can play four, two, three, one. But like, you can have two central midfielders there who are more defensive. But yeah, yeah. For me, we only need if we play with, if we play Henderson. I'll be honestly no shit, and I'm, I know this is going to sound really disrespectful to somebody, but I would rather have Chippers playing than Henderson. Oh, <laughs> well, you can. I think I'm just going to rattle through these. I'd rather have wait a minute. I'd rather have Chippers, <laughs> man. Oh, well, no, I will say, John Henderson, I've heard he's out the game tomorrow with injury. Oh, oh good, old old. Uh, good evening, Jim. Up your well. Chippers wants to drink out of Granny Fanny's fairy cup. Oh, oh. <laughs> who doesn't? Oh, Jesus. Who does? Good show for your lads. Good evening, Mary, as well. You're welcome to people. Louis is wearing his wrestling pants underneath, says uh, Via. <laughs> no, not tonight. <laughs> Wanky Robson. You got your wet white boots after you live Liverpool Everton. I never pick my favourites, otherwise I would be with my Mrs. Sister, oh. says uh, I thought that, you know, that's like what I said. I said this is what you could have won. Be a Vi who the fuck is be a Viking? He, he needs to get on one of these shows. Yeah, I've said for a long time, be a Viking is... John, you just blew your own point. They get a Southgate to text her at Lost Gate, tried to spell tactics. He came up with Henderson and got confused. Ash, uh, Ash, uh, it's not there, second. It's not there. Ash, yeah. sorry. I'll rephrase that, mate, right? Gal Southgate should play 4 2 3 1, right? That's what I'm saying. 4 2 3 1, yeah. right? And keep to that formation, yeah? Because that's our best option of winning games. Best option going all the way. Can that's we do it. it? He's got to play Forden. He's got to play Bellingham anyway. And yeah. then Harry's going to play up front, yeah. And if Saka's fit, play him as well. He's going to be playing yeah, as well. Saka, but... Saka, Saka is our best, best, most creative. <laughs> Tom's joke. Rice is great, but better than chips. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> James will post us another Leticia when it comes to Togland. Uh, Granny says, spent my whole pension on only dogs earlier. Pitch said, oh, oh my God. No. Nah. Man. Anyway, Chivers, do you know what I thought you had had a rant about in a way? Steve Bruce said he was the victim. Oh, oh, he's a. F I, I almost forgot about that cabbage headed twat, to be honest with you, because well, I want to forget about him. You know, I just. Well, why is he still talking? It's Dashley why is he still Andrews. Talking? Yeah, why, why is Talksport giving him this airtime? I'm sorry to joke, and then, like, you know, it's it's all oh, too quick since it's cool. Yeah, it's all. It's all it's all too coincidental this has come off a week or two after what Amanda said about him, which seems to me as if, you know, that's why I just had to apologise, because either he was going to make an appearance and say something, or a lawyer probably got involved. Um, that was I it. Just, it. To me, he's a complete villain, and, you know, I love how he, like, he was asked about Jordan, and he went, well, you know, you know, I don't have to take the credit for Joe Linton, because Steve Nixon and the recruitment staff already had him there. And you know, I did. I I had nothing to do with Joe Linton, although I wish I had my name next to him. For fuck off, you prick! And I went. You know, the time I was there, 
I, I knew he wasn't a striker, yet he still played him as a striker every game. I mean, come on. All you need to say to that fucking Bellend is how many caps did you get for England, you fucking useless uh, fat headed cunt. You know it, what I mean? You know what annoyed me <laughs> even more? <laughs> Emily's just gone, Ian. Do you know what annoyed me even more? The fact he came out and said that Marjan Manu would have been the pinnacle of the when he said after the Arsenal yeah. game against for O.C. Gans, it was the most proudest moment of his career and his dad would be proud looking down on him. I'm sorry, you've just totally annihilated yourself there, Steve. To be honest, you're big nose twat. By coming out and nobody, coming out with nobody, all this... Nobody would, be, nobody, would, nobody would be proud of looking down on a man who's made his fortune from getting sacked. Yeah, that's it. But, but what I do is eight million reasons. He's made more yeah. money from being sacked than he has from working. And, uh, again, the saying he was the victim and everything. I mean, bullshit. Um, yep. No, 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 he, is the victim. he is the victim, Pete. He is the victim because he makes himself the victim. <laughs> <laughs> That's I it. I tell you what, I hope he does get another football club ever again. I really don't because they can see right through him now, right? I, mean, I hope he does. I hope he goes back to I Rackham. can't say. To be fair, I can't, I can't see. say through him his waistline's that big. <laughs> and another I mean. one I was expecting around on chip is Mike Ashley. He's a oh, no, he's just a felon. I'm so, I mean, I'm sorry it's not our fault. Sports Direct don't stock Adidas stock and we're going Adidas, so <laughs> up yours, you big bellend. I how's he how's he taking legal That's action it. against us for well do we have for, for, is it for doing a deal with a company that don't sell to him, surely he needs to go do Adidas, eh? Yeah, Adidas. I mean, sure, sure, I didn't want right. in, right. I didn't want into Sports it's Direct and say like another team's Adidas shit. Surely yeah. it's not legally binding for us to cut our shirts in that shop. It's not against the law, is it? We don't have to. No, no offense. No. In the Castor shop in Newcastle, you don't see man new tops, do you? So you don't see no. us going to sue. There you go. So why should we have to have shirts in Sports Direct? We don't. It's not. Well, it's not a law. We were done Barcelona shirts in our under Ashley before because when we had Puma's right, under manufacturers. Ashley. Yeah. Not now. Because we want to sell our own brand. Aye. Yep. Uh, we're up to when we comments. Well, South Graph claim one Southgate is my new choice. So it's the next manager. So it's the next choice. Best option That's to re- get rid of Southgate. My Bassett has more chance of winning the Euro. I agree with that. <laughs> Bruce. Steve Bruce is like a tear that one. Flush. Four, Bruce, four, you four, talk four, more two. shit than a sewage plant you toss out. I thought that was Steve Bruce there. Steve Bruce is like stepping in old dog shit. Good evening, Paul. Good evening, Paul, as well. If his dad was the big NUF seat round, Bruce reckons he must have been spinning in his grave. Most football fans were victims having to watch a straight football. We were calling them cabbage as offense is offensive to cabbages. Bruce, yeah, I like, ca- I like cabbage. A bit of braised uh-huh. Savoy cabbage. <laughs> I've had, had a magician for my kids' birthday today. They are 500 at a time, but I found out a magician to do it for free. His name is the Great Molest. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, Granny says Sinclair's looking like hot stuff tonight. Oh, hey. Mason's popped up in the chat. I hope you, Mason's popped up in the chat. I hope you're well, Mason. And um, Oh, I caught it for Where's Mason? Where's Mason been? Uh, he's uh, taking some time out. He's taking some time out on the channel just for a little Mason, bit. If you want to, if you want to contact me anytime, and I'm not being a knob here, I fucking love you, Mason. Like top lad, yeah, you know where I am. Fucking love you, man. Because Cardiff got me in last week. No Swansea. Mason loves me. He supports Cardiff, doesn't he? As he's seen the injection to allow him to sell shit in the competition. Mason, I love Mason. He's a fucking top lad. Yeah, just choked. He, is. he, so is. Now, he will get anywhere near that lawsuit because Adidas's contracts with JD Sports not shy direct. Yep, and Mason has just taken some time out due to mental health. Get yeah, well that's soon, right. Mason. Get well soon, Mason. That's it. Absolutely. And hopefully we'll see you back again very, very soon. In the DMs open anytime, absolutely, says Tom. You know, all of our DMs are open as well. Mason, Mason, you need to come back to help my mental health because I've got to put up with fucking chippers. You know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> Be grateful I'm here. <laughs> right, where's, are we doing the food? Is this not ten, the fucking food one? Ten minutes time, Ian. 
Yeah. Fuck yeah, I'm dying for this scrum. Yeah, I'll be back in the middle for a few picks on a scam the bog, okay? For Don't a take your phone with you. Don't. Oh, no. <laughs> anyway, St. So John, John, what did you make about all the Steve Bruce coming out with saying he was a victim mm -hmm. when he was manager at Newcastle? To me, I'll be honest with you, Pete, I think it's a load of BS. He's looking for a sympathy for your vote, in my opinion. I'm watching very, listening very carefully, like, you know what I mean? And it's the same old Steve Bruce playing the victim, feel something for himself, what's this feel something for himself, do you know what I mean? But he's still talking BS anyway, do you know what I mean? He's come out and he said that our football club, right, is um, not in debt, there's um, not very much money, and then all he does, he just get on with it, blah, 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 right? But we all know what Steve is talking about. He makes a lot of mistakes. The guy is an absolute bellend. He really, really is, Pete. And the, yeah. so, the, the sooner all of our fan base, no, all not. our football club, right, forgets about Steve Bruce now, the better. We're moving on, yeah? We don't Absolutely. want to be talking about this guy. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. Let's talk about the future, yeah? But this yeah, guy, yeah. right, he's come out. Sorry, Pete. This guy's come out. And you know what? He's just still talking absolute crap. He's always okay. united. He's always a red. And let's move him on, man. Yep. Anyway, I'm going to bring another guest on. And we have a debut on the channel as well. It's good evening, Barbara. Fucking Hello. get in, Barbara. We're all heading over from Creepy Yarbrough to things. Where have you been all our lives, Barbara? Mm. I, I was yeah. on Creepy yeah. with you tonight. Yeah, yeah, she was. Yeah, you were, weren't you, Barbara? So it was all set up. I bought a load of um, broadcasting equipment, like fancy, fancy gear. Like so, I set a trail out tonight. Yeah, Barbara, how are you doing? How are you doing? I um, saw you. How are you doing, John? And, and, and thanks for that big, big chat you you, you probably got me the other night. You praised me. No. Any time we do, Bob. Any time we do, man. Just um, you know, Lovely just um, get yeah. definitely get on my channel. Go we'll come on my channel anytime. You know that. Yeah, we will we'll do it. Yeah, yeah, we'll do it now. Yeah, I have all the screen now, so I have to use it. You know? Cool. Big up, big up. <laughs> I'll be keeping well there, uh, Barbara. What were your thoughts about uh, the Man City defeat? <laughs> Where have we gone, Barbara? Mm. Oh, she's went somewhere. I'm grand. I'm grand. Um, oh, you're good, yeah, yeah. It was a bit of a nothing, uh, nothing performance, wasn't it? We didn't really try hard. Open for, for the curtains. Which? Oh. Oh. I think we're losing you, Barbara. Why, why am I not? I'm not there. Yeah, I can hear you. We can hear you. Can't see you. Just can't see you. Have you closed the curtains on the top of your cam? What? I can see that's what that's what Chippers usually does when he gets his willy out. At least I can see mine. Oh, oh, God, man! Oh, man! Unbelievable, man. Uh, Barbara, you've got black, man. Um, did anyone listen to Unite Emery, right? When he did that yeah. interview regarding Ollie Watkins the other day? I'm not going to say yeah. it on here, right? But he was asked a question and he said that, oh, Ollie had to come at half time because he had a bank on. Yeah. Uh, uh, yes, says, is Chippers going to update us on Katie? Katie Who's Katie? Yeah. Exactly, okay. Middleton. Oh. Uh, here Guess comes. Good, hey, look who else is here. Oh, oh. Look, oh he was off the village. You know, look, do you know what that is? That's a sight I've not seen. Where have you been as well, Archer? None of you bricks have been around. Like, um, I, I was on last week. No, I'm not talking about on here, I'm talking about in real life. Oh, in real life, he's not real, man. We're all made <laughs> believe people. We're all I'm not CGI asking, people. I'm not asking about you pricks on here. When I go to the match, I go along and I'm looking for you. The only fucker I see is Pete. You know what I mean? I was, I was saying, <laughs> you come and think I'm running the other direction because I'll miss the start of the kickoff. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm wrestling with Newcastle Pete Place, so I can't help that. Pete doesn't chip us because he wants to bite me burger. Oh. <laughs> it's better than a bite yourself. Do you remember when... Um... 
Remember when Lewis was on the channel a few we yeah. weeks ago? Yeah. And we oh. had the Thomas the Tank engine oh, debacle. That was Fuck that. I have found a picture which I'll now put on my green screen, oh. which I don't have. Oh. Have a look at this. Here we go. Hang on. Hang on. Here it is. Oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> is it melting? <laughs> <laughs> Hang on, if I share the full picture, uh, how the What's hell do What's the white stuff coming out of it? Well, it's supposed to be a birthday cake. <laughs> <laughs> That's a birthday cake? Like... What the hell? It's supposed to be a birthday cake. It's freaking, it's Archie's birthday. Uh, hang on. Was that as well? The dildo sticking on the other side of the line. What the hell's happening with That's... Steamer? I've shared my screen. That's the full picture. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. That's white stuff coming over. What the <laughs> fuck <laughs> hell is that? What that the like, hell? That looks like oh, Chip no. has just crawled out of. Fucking... That looks like the human. <laughs> that looks like something like the human centipede. That. No, that I... looks like Chip. That looks like Chip has just crawled out of Irani Granny's mouth. Oh! Uh, I'm, oh. I'm bigger than that. <laughs> anyway. Let's get sure. through yeah. some more of these comments. Ian, was that, was, was that like... our live, you know, not one woman has ever seen this party sausage. Uh, good evening, Aunt Asset. Hope you're well. He's in Blackpool. Just seen a princess have been dealing with cancer. Yes, she has. And uh, oh, oh, speedy yeah. recovery. Uh, Chippers could pull Quasi Mordoff's cast offs. How Sophia Chippers says Mason. I was called like Mason. Mason. Thomas the Tank Engine has been oh. unsheathed. <laughs> Where is Lewis anyway? Oh, so I've still, still, still got that one. Oh god. Oh god. Oh, <laughs> that one. Oh. <laughs> that one. Oh, I'm a bit worried by his whole drive to be honest. This was full of toss <laughs> oh, Where's your face gone? You're black. I think Barbara's gone um, completely. Bobby is still there? I'm, I'm gone, am I? Oh, you're there. Yeah, well, well, you, might have pressed, you might have pressed stop is cam. Is the cam not working? No, it. no, uh, we can hear you, though. Yeah. Maybe not, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> now you've put a picture of fucking Archer on. Oh, oh, now oh. we have, uh, I will, I'm loving you know, you know, like every other <laughs> woman in our day. I don't have too you, many yo. standards to go <laughs> with Jim as Mr. Spoon Spoon. Is that working Iran, now? Isn't it? No, it's not wicked. Yeah, you're though still. Yeah, yeah. Barbara's invincible. It looks like it, doesn't she? Thomas the tank ran out with steam, says Mary. Yep. <laughs> I think he ran with something else as well. Oh, Jesus left. He's ran with something jizz by the looks of it. <clears throat> so a pan, I think I think be a Viking should come on here. Like what Julie said, maybe he oh, needs some what is Julie putting there? Is that a chicken? It's either a is it a chipmunk or something? Cockerel. Is it a cockerel? I think it's a squirrel. I or back to tell what that is. It looks something like that. Oh, or he beaver. needs some beaver. beaver. Oh, we're not Canadians oh. or French or whatever. Or... Hey Julie, who doesn't? We can all we can all do some more. You've all got PS sensors me too much. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, oh, that one, Louis. Honestly, truly, a fucking one of me be a Viking. I've went to a whole different realm now. Uh, I say, Peter, I can't <laughs> believe Botman's used for six to nine months. It's unbelievable. Oh, you have to bring the fucking. You have to bring it down, Archie. You know, <laughs> you know, anyway. I'm talking about that one, man. <laughs> We're just about to get on the food and the hot dogs and dog cocks and all that. You know what I mean? Looking forward to that, though. Looking forward to that, man. Right, then. Yep. So, so you watch random more? pictures during the show. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> what is that? What is that? <laughs> what is that? <laughs> oh, someone's got YouTube in the background. I thought I could hear me twice. Uh... Oh, no. I can't. Oh, hey. There we are. Okay. Anyway, oh, and now we're gone. I don't know. Anyway, and now we're gone, you know what it means. Dick pic. What the fuck's that yeah. mean? What the fuck's <laughs> that behind, Louie? 
Looks like Lee Evans. I found it on the internet, right? I just found it random like shit on the internet. You. Right, we've got 25 <laughs> picks tonight. Oh, Jesus. Wow. Left. Peter. Oh, wow. oh, no, actually, no, sorry, 24. Four of them, at least four of them, are once Tony sent me when he was in Albania. Oh, Jesus right. Christ. He must be like dead dogs or Wait, something. So... Other? Dick, right. He's actually bought it. Well, you sent me them when he was what in he, Albania. What's he doing on holiday in Albania? Don't well, just steal was, cars that was, that or whatever. Weeks... Well, he was on holiday. That was a few weeks ago. So, he's... Yeah. so what Tony's done is shared what he had on holiday to eat. He did. Well, yes, he's he did. Oh, I think so... oh, Bob has gone off there. Right, then. I hope, uh... they I hope, I hope them hot dogs are normal. Right, first pick tonight. Let's get it on screen. It's yeah, a dick. Well, that be... That's not bad. Oh, what the it's hell's a, in that bag? It's a chicken, Guy Ross and Chips at Slough Town. No, no, no. That's not, that's not. No, no, by the way, you said that wrong. It's Guy Ross. Oh, okay, fair it's, enough. It's, gyros, it's, it's not Gyros. <coughs> it's Greek. Oh, whatever what it is. Gyros, I, is. gyros is what your mum's been on for all her life. Chippers. Saved at Slough no. Town for 10 quid. No, mm. I don't know. I'd eat it, but not pay a tenner, so no. You need that? Did they just come off the back of a van? I would eat that, aye. Uh, anyone else, yes or no? Not for 10 no. quid. No. Not for 10 quid. Nah. It's just chips and a bit of fucking cheek. Like, whatever that is, isn't it? Okay. Fair that. enough, fair enough. Right, next one. I've seen this. It looks, like a, it looks like a mashed up cheeseburger from McDonald's. It's cheeseburger load, cheeseburger loaded fries at Leeds United oh, for seven fifty. How much, Pete? Seven fifty. Seven fifty. Oh, mm. yeah, you pay that like at McDonald's? Nothing, I think. If that was five quid, I'd pay for it. Seven fifty. Well, I don't think that looks too bad. It, what? It looks like it look too bad. But chips. seven pounds fifty. It looks like your uh, ex girlfriend's arsehole after I had a go on her. Oh! oh. oh. <laughs> Oh, I haven't, I haven't, I haven't had an ex girlfriend, so it'd be a hard, it'd be a shit miserable. Eh? It looks like, no, it looks like if Harvey Price ate a cheeseburger and spat it out. Well, I think Barbara's trying to get back on you there, Barbara. Ian, is that is that Emily's cooking? Is that Emily's cooking? <laughs> Do you know what? Uh, hey, hey, there she is. The camera's back on now. Yay! Yay. Right, Barbara. anyone else say yes or no to that one? No, not for seven fifty. I'm tempted, no. but no. Not for me. You're tempted. You're good. I'm tempted, <laughs> but not, not for fucking seven pound fifty. Come on. Right, not next. for seven fifty, but I'm it's tempted. It's basically a bit of it's chips with a bit of mince on it and cheese. <laughs> nah. <laughs> right. Ne okay. Next one. Oh, my phone. Oh, what the fuck's that? Ah, oh, he nearly just... <laughs> <laughs> he nearly just did it. He just had a little trouble here. That mushroom. <laughs> right. Someone's barbecue, better than both. It's a barbecued pork with a bun at FC. <laughs> are out. What the fuck is that? Oh, how much oh, is yeah, that? Um, bloody hell, they're charging 11 50 for that. Oh, oh nice. Nice. Anyway, here comes Tony. Hi guys, alright? Yeah. Yeah. I don't know if you've yeah. missed there. Uh, what have you caught up with there? Uh, what's been coming on, Tony? Yet? Um, I just saw that one before the gear rush. That one, yes. What would you say yeah. about that one? Shit as fuck. Pointless. Dry. Doesn't look as Gandhi's flip Doesn't look like a gear rush. Dry. Doesn't even. <laughs> <laughs> okay, what about this one, Tony? That looks like sick on chips, doesn't it? Uh, that one. <laughs> Quasimodo's what on dick. earth is that? What it's is that? Barbecue pork with a bun at FC Arrow. It's called for a It looks like the biggest magic mushroom I've ever found in my life. I would still be. It's Quasimodo's it. dick. I would oh. still be tripping if I'd have took that when I was 16. That, yeah. that's, I'm sorry, that, that, then, that's Tutankhamun's dick on a mushroom, that. It's been dug up, that. You can sell the of it. The okay. fossil? Right. <laughs> the uh, fossil. Right, next one. Cock. Right, next. Oh, I think Bob has got to get right. Bob's next one. Again. 
Oh, hello. Oh, Jesus. Are you seeing where you found it as well? <laughs> <laughs> 12 inches of pleasure. Is that Hot from Anne Summers, is it? Hot dog at Crystal Palace for 480. Where's that's the Roy Hutchins? Bloody, that's Crystal Palace. Yeah. It's Roy Hutchins. Bloody hell, not, look at the size of Roy Hutchins. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Tell you what, I've got to admit, like the sausage don't look that bad, but the bun. Aye. Where's the bun? It's a brioche the bun. The sausage is too big for the bun. Anyone else? Yes or no? That's a Roy Hutchins oh, special, yes. look like a seller's pork. How much? <coughs> who, said how, who said how much? How much? Four pound eighty. <laughs> four pound eighty. <laughs> four is four that in inches or? Oh. That's what I want to know. Someone went, how much? Like, Anyone else? Yes, someone. Uh, no, 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 no. No I'm sex toys allowed, guys. Okay, next one. <laughs> Who sat on that? Oh. <laughs> I'd be into a bit of that. That's, what what that's got them that way. Like. It's chilly. That naturals. Yeah, chili beef nachos at Folkestone and Victor for nine. How much though? Nine fifty. Fuck off! Oh, crisps. again, overpriced. Crisps. crisps with some tomato salsa and fuck right off. Doritos. Looks nice, but I'm not paying nine pound fifty for it. No, no, it looks dead nice, but that's that's half a it's pack of Doritos a... with a bit of fucking cheese mm-hmm. string on it. Fuck off! I'm you saying, just get a bag of Doritos for one fifty. Anyone else? Yes or no? No. Mm-mm. Nope. No. Not for me. Barbara, what do you think of that? Barbara, you there? You there, Barbara? I can't put that on the stream. I can't do that. She can't I hate that. Na- no, do you know what it is? I don't mind nachos, right? But I want nachos. If I'm eating that fucking... Like, look how small the hand is as well. You can see the fucking... Like, if I'm eating that, I'm expecting it to be three quid. You there, Bob? Bob, Barbara, what do you think of that? I don't think Barbara can hear us. Okay, next one. What is that, Louis? <laughs> it's oh. the idea of the food tonight because Billy's not here. Right, next one. What the fuck's that? The call the this a call this a bee's breakfast at Brentford. All right, I bet they're charging the stupid price again. Uh, it's a downsized McMuffin. Twelve fifty. It's, it's for a McDonald's. That. It's a McDonald's. Twelve fifty for that. That's London prices there. Eh? Yep. Well, for Premier me. League London. Or um, even Pat. I'm Pat sorry, Pat like, but I ain't paid twelve fifty for that. Uh, totally you want to get the same that? at McDonald's? Where is it? No, nah, not that's not worth twelve fifty. No chance. I don't know how much dips empty. Half, half and half dips. There's no winning. No. I'll be definitely. honest. I'd rather eat that than a lot of the other shit that's come over before. Okay. But fair I, would, enough. I would probably, I'd probably eat that for about eight quid. Right. Next one. <laughs> <laughs> no comment. Oh. I'm sorry, John, is that you, Rami? <laughs> Oh! Oh! <laughs> uh, nacho cheese dog, anyone? Oh, yeah, I wouldn't touch that. I'll go with Julie. Yeah, I wouldn't touch that. Uh, how much? Uh, six quid for that. <laughs> Where's the Again, phone? Oh, price. Honestly, oh. not one of the things we've seen on here so far. It's been time. like, well, everything we've seen so far, it's been overpriced. Let me find. Out Nothing's been edible. fucking edible. Nothing's been edible. I will have a look, see where... I, I forgot to put where the club it was served at. Let's have a look. Um, Right, hold on, let me find it. Julie J's just said, ha, ha, ha draw on a cocktail. <laughs> <laughs> I'll win. Julie J. Right, There's a lot of us. If I just one, one yeah, I found it. Saved out Rangers. 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 <laughs> no wonder they're tight on the mustard sauce, aren't they? Or whatever it is on the top. 
There's uh, probably a fucking razor blade in there. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Someone's gone. Anyone, sit else? On <laughs> Anyone else see yes or no to that one? That's a no for nope. me. No, it's a rollover hot dog. No. Right, next one. Rollover would be better than that. Dill, do. Wow, Alex, all right for half a pizza. Half a pizza. Saved an awful lot. It's London. It's London. Okay, so you know quid, it's going to be a stupid price again. <laughs> half a pizza. 30 that quid. Price. We're charging 11 30 for that. Oh, what? Where? Where? Of course, we get these picks when Billy's not on to say, Fuck off! Fuck yeah, off! Yeah. Not for me. Not not at all. Not a chance. <laughs> no. I mean, how much is that one, Pete? How much? 11 11.30? I tell you what. Where? Go to New York, go to London, go to Paris. I <clears> tell <throat> you what, you get better quality <clears throat> food in, in Rome. You got a lot more food. You got to pay for us to go there, John. Lee. You get it's very expensive to go in New York. Okay, next one. Oh, Barbara's back. Next one. Oh, yes. Oh, is that, that a burger? It's a pulled pork burger at Hull City for five ninety five. No. That was yep. the best I've seen no. all night. Yeah. 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 Not too that. bad. Not too bad. Yeah. It's Not too maybe... bad. Anyone else? It's going to be a lot worse. I think so, yeah, if, you, if that includes the mm. chips. It's acceptable. Fair, Fair enough. enough. Looks looks stunning to me. Yeah, it doesn't look too bad. Okay, next one. How much? How much? Five ninety five ninety five. Fucking all day. I'll be having that. All day. <sighs> right, next one. <laughs> what the hell? It's a bacon cheeseburger, I'm guessing. It is. Granny Fanny, oh, yes. over to you. But it looks like Harvey Price's ears just been cut off oh, and stuck in the burger. Uh, oh. Saved at West Ham. Or Harvey Price's... Hey. Saved Katie Price's it, flaps or something. Saved at West Ham. Got to uh, do it with 10 hours, £9.90 for that. What? Oh, the, nah. the cheese isn't even melted. Aye, I hate that as well. The Anyone? fact that Archer, oh, the fact that Archer, Archer hasn't even made a noise. That's how bad that is. <laughs> to me, the patties look dry. Like, there's no juice <laughs> in this whatsoever. Anyone Archer's else? Yes or no? Uh, no. It's a no it's for a no. me. He didn't even make a noise. No. Especially for that price. Awful. Okay, right. Next one and. Oh Jesus! What? Let's have a look. Oh, oh my word! <laughs> is that a That's cheesy a chip with curry, curry sauce? Curry. Please tell me, is that at Norwich City? If it is, it's Delia Smith It's not oh, cheesy oh. chips. <laughs> cheesy no, chips with curry sauce? Yeah. Oh, cheesy chips! Oh, never tried it, and I never will. That saved at Rangers for four quid. Where? Oh. Rangers for Rangers. four quid. Rangers. Oh. Even Fucking for four hell. quid, no. That's what I used to get served up with the rugby club, that like. That's regurgitation, that like. That's that's awful, that. <clears throat> it looks like someone's just hide flipping chlamydia with it. Oh, no! <laughs> oh god. <laughs> nap, nap, nap. <laughs> There's <laughs> two fat ladies left over us. Yash your doodles back on the chlamydia. <laughs> oh! <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's a definite no. Curry sauce, curry sauce and cheese. Nah. Oh, I've, Billy, I've seen some weird takeaways, but not Curry like sauce that. on that cheese. <laughs> Fuck off. Okay, next one. Oh! <laughs> no, no, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Someone is asking me, John, what would John Scott <laughs> take my taking selfies for? <laughs> <laughs> uh, That's a 12 inch. Hot dog and Harrogate uh -huh. time for 6 50 Not for me. Harrogate. Mm. What, <laughs> what the hell's on the end of it? The that looks like a bell end off of it. It's oh. sticking out. You can tell it's circumcised. <laughs> <laughs> it I mean, all right, but. Circumcised, hot dog. 
Imagine, so just, imagine waving that around in Harrogate. <laughs> Look at the size of that. <laughs> yes, I know. Looks like, it, looks like the guy's giving a good rubber to shine. Oh. Mm, I don't think I paid 650. I would, I would say that's a sloppy jaw, that like. Uh, not for me. Right, next it's one. Harrogate are selling that concern. They're supposed to be up market there, aren't they? Right. Okay, next one. Oh. The elephant man cometh. For a margarita, that's poor. Right. Pepperoni, oh, it's pepperoni? I think. It's pepperoni? Pizza red. Oh, it's pepperoni? TS, TSV 1860 Ross of mine for four quid. Yeah, I think I'd have that. Uh, no. Anyone else? Yes or no? Nah, because I don't like pepperoni. Oh, so you don't like pepperoni? No, tell me. I like, I like no, pepperoni. No, no, no. I understand no. it. Wow, I'm very... Wow, what's I prefer, the, what's, what I prefer you know? a well, Kiev. Well, it's not pizza. What's it with pepperoni no, you don't like, pizza. Tony? It's too spicy for me. John, would you have that? Oh. Too spicy, not for me. Fair enough. Okay, nah, next one. Definitely not. No, no, no. Next one. <laughs> Just be a... Oh, that's sad. <laughs> Scotch pie. In the now cup. I'm guessing that's gravy, not coffee. No, it's bovril. I knew it was bovril. Oh, oh that's that's bovril. Bovril. even though I don't have it, bro. Uh, the pie is steak and black pudding. No, I've never had it? bovril. It's a Scotch pie. Steak and black pudding, and how much is it? Altogether, for all of that is a fiver. Where from? Mm, I don't think I pay a fiver. That looks like a Scotch pie. Saved it all. Yeah, it does, doesn't it? Ian looks like saved it's a scotch pie. And I'll tell you it's what, that like pie, no? saved it all. Like broth. It, that looks like a fucking good scotch pie as well. <laughs> to no, so any, no, from me. Thin pastry. I've never had bovril, so thin pa- I've fucked the bovril, thin pastry, and lots of uh, lots of uh, <clears> mint, <throat> lamb inside it. Mm. I thought it was from Manchester. I think that's a Scotch pie. <laughs> you know what? I'd have that. I'd have that. Right, next. Uh, anyone else? Yes or no for that one? No. I'm yes. saying yes. No. Not for the price. Right, I'm next one. Bovril, I'll pay three quid for the pie. Right, next one. Oh, it's 2 0 to Holland and Genie went out of the scores. I like right, this um, one. Right, oh, yeah, Tom, Lynch is right. Oh. Tom Lynch is right. Scotch pies are beautiful. Tom Lynch is right. Uh, right. Chicken pulled pork and chips at Doncaster Rovers for seven fifty. Yes. That looks yeah. good, yeah. but I don't know if I pay seven fifty. Yes. Mm, yeah, all right, probably. You know what? I'd have that. Yes, that's a yes for me. Do you know what yeah. I'd say? No. Do you know what I'd, you know I'd say? No, because there's about four chips in there. Look at look look <laughs> at the size of that fucking fork. They're probably right hiding underneath there. They're buried yeah. right yeah. underneath the... And then, and then like, like if you're going to... Even though 450 isn't that much, there's nothing in there. That's the smallest portion ever. That's not going to fill one of us. It's certainly, certainly not going to fill well, Archer. You know what I mean? The thing is, the no. thing is, all oh, right, I mean, we're going to these places, right? I mean, you get a very small portion, right? But you got to pay a lot of money for it. Not only that, you got a cost of living as well too. I'm not going to lie, but it should give you a size of bullshit. If you go to America, right, you get double the size for yep. value for money. Mm. Well, the yeah, yeah, and, then, yeah and and not only oh, that, yeah. everyone dies of heart disease. This oh. is true. Are we there? Is so, sort of now, Barbara. <laughs> Look at that. I don't think she could hear us still. Right, next one. What the hell oh. is that? That looks like a wrap. It's a chicken tikka, uh, chicken chica chips wrap. I thought saved that, <coughs> saved that East Thurrock United for five fifty. You know what? I'll try that. that. Nah. I think looks, it like, looks like Katie Price's period. Nah. Oh! oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> nah, be much baggier than that. <clears throat> Anyone I would have said, I would have said, Peter Smith, mate. 
<laughs> I would have said Delia <laughs> Smith. Me. Oh God! Let's be having you. Let's, Let's be having you. <laughs> That's becoming you. Look, hey, Archer, looks like every fuck is on that. Uh, right, next one. Oh, Jesus, here we go. Oh, oh my God. God. <laughs> <laughs> I tell you what, guys, if you go to a nightclub... I'll club, be a man. Right? Okay. If you go to, like, to a nightclub, right, and you had, uh, you know, like a big... <laughs> Sorry? I tell you what, you get chatted up every single time. You know, don't oh, know the the hell the you got a big woman to it. <laughs> that little field that. that looks like a big On the way like past... Sorry, do you go to a sex club like John or something and flash it like get out? Like, <laughs> Ooh. Uh, what do we right. think of that? What's Bigla. this? Bigla. Right, what's this? How much and where from? What's Spicy sausage and AC Prada Spot Sparta Prog for three quid. Bloody hell. Yeah, three that. quid? Do I, do I have a sex shop here? By it's way, a big sausage in it. Cameron Diaz sit next to them. <laughs> Adam, that, make sure I'll get a drink though because that is. Probably gonna be spicy. It'll last you till the full time, that. I've never been to Prague, so I would love One person on one end, the other person on the other. I try to think what else Archer would say about that. <laughs> Next. Three quid. Yeah, I'd have that. Next one. Oh, that's chicken nuggets and chips. All the chicken chips and chips are. Knee sauce. Nine quid for a portion of that size. Fuck off. <coughs> Nine quid no, for that knee sauce? Nah, no thanks. Well, I suppose you can add sauce, but still, nine quid. Nah. nah, 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 nah. Anyone else? What, yes or no? Nah, Where's that? No. Nine quid. F FC Zurich. All right. Uh, Tony, is that not a no for you as well? Yeah, it's a no for me. That price, how many? Oh, four nuggets as well. Is that it? I'm not I'll go with Julie, Julie J, right? Not very appetizing, isn't it? You want, I want more than that. Looks dry. Right, uh, next one. Oh. Mm. What is that? It's supposed to be a pull. It's a pulled pork roll at New Mills for five fifty. Oh, looks, like looks, looks like one of them alien face things. Are flipping what? Like you know? How's that? Anyone else? Yes, I know. John got a vibrator on or something. Mm, no. Looks like so looks like somebody. John's got his vibrator on. No, looks like something. Not, not me. Not me. Not me. That, that that's looks like face, something. That's all them. That is one of them face hookers off here, isn't it? What were Look, you saying there, Tony? Looks like that. Looks like something that's just fell out of somebody's ass. Oh, I dread to think what Archer would say about that. Looks like shit. You see, you're straight to the point with this one. Okay, uh, next one. Oh. <laughs> Fuck Drink or cut chips. Yeah, chicken curry and chips at Buxton FC for a no. fiver. No, them chicken curry chunks look massive. You see the size of them. Mm. I'd have that. I'd say yes to that. Same. No. Probably Tesco Tesco bit. value crinkle cut chips. <laughs> <laughs> I can see Archer's face. He's thinking, what can I say for this one? Looks, that, a bit like so, looks a bit like someone chopped a cow's bollocks and just hide it on a fucking pile of chips. Oh. <laughs> Anyone else say yes or no for that one? No. 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 <clears throat> Doesn't look that nice. I don't have that. Do you know what? I'd say yes to that. Right, last one. Yeah. Bit of a strange one here. Right, Basilton Football Club must be growing, must have a berry bush. That's a yes for me, by the way. I'm with Tony. I think I heard Tony say yes. Right. This next one. Sorry? Uh, this, this no, I didn't say yes. I said no, Ian. 
Well, I'm, I'm, well, I would say, how much was it though? Yeah, that was a that was a fiver. Well, going off the other prices of twelve quid, I'd probably say yes to that because that looks like it's got some chunky chicken in there. There you are. Right, last one. Now, Basilton must be growing a berry bush in their football club because someone has been picking the berries off it. Oh, that's been sick. It's, what it, it's, the hell? Bagels, is it? 50 Steve, pence? Pick as many as you want and you can have them for nothing. Bagels, um, was it? Whoever you know, that depends. is. That's, that's, whoever... obviously, that's obviously Chip as his mum. <laughs> oh! <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? And I actually know what Chippers' man looks like, so I'm a fucking big yes. He doesn't. I do. <laughs> not for me. Uh, no, well, not for me. Kind of tin of Louis, Louis, berries around. Chippers' man, in, you probably had, had, Louis, you've probably wrestled against her, you know what I mean? And she would have beat you. <laughs> 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 <clears throat> Anyone else? Blackberries or oh yeah, Tom. I just got you. Out. <laughs> I've just looked Get at your comment. Me? I... Who, the, who the fuck said I don't <laughs> like blackberries? Me? Right. I never like blackberries or blueberries. Right. <laughs> I'm realise I missed one that Tom sent me, so I'm just gonna have to share this one. Okay. Right. This is the one Tom's just sent me, and I forgot to get this one up. Right. Tom sent me this oh, one. Oh, Bia. Not you, Pete. Oh. Oh, I'd eat that. How much, Tom? Right, Tom sent oh, me this, no, right? No. How much, Tom? Right, oh, Tom. I forgot about I that one. love a mushy pea. Right. Steak pie, mushy peas, and gravy out Rochdale for £3.80. Yes, pound I'm 80. all over that. £3.80? Yes, that's not right. £3.80, right. yes, I'd have that. Mad and all. I'd have two of them, what? Tom. I'd have two. I'd have that, yes. Julie J would have that as well. There you are. There you are. Right everyone then. Loves, uh... everyone, loves, everyone loves Julie J. Not as much as me, but everyone loves Julie J. You know right, I mean? the yeah. last few picks are yours, Tony, that you've sent me. Yeah. So These taking away be... with that, they're taking away with that oh. one. That's margarita pizza. Um right. Looks, looks like you bought it from Lidl and you cooked it yourself. So <laughs> no, no. One pound, one pound eighty. You're not far off. Two pound ten for a twelve-inch margarita pizza in Albania. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah I'd, go for that. That. I'd go for that. And that is really nice, oh. and I can honestly say it is. Antony, Antony, was it served by an Albanian girl? <laughs> God. <laughs> <laughs> but no, <clears throat> my other half, she had that, and uh, I had a piece of her. And, uh, yeah, it was really. What, nice. what did you have? Uh, Big, you'll see in a minute. Players, dog cock. <laughs> ah. This is another one to Tony sent. Now that, now that Tony, now you're friends with John again, did you have the Right, this is another one Tony sent. So, Tony, take it away with this one. Yeah, that's uh, chicken souvlaki. Oh, um, and that that was really really nice, and that was only one pound sixty. Jesus, um, everything was cooked to perfection. Uh, couldn't fault the food at all, and uh, it was really really nice. <clears throat> I bet it was the football really shit fun. though. I don't. I didn't see any football when I was over there. Oh, so I was only. So you, I was only. So you've just took pictures of food. Hmm. Why not? No, that's not from the football. That's not from the football. Well, I, thought I, went to... fo I thought it was football food. Well, no, I had to put them on. No, no, no. Uh, Tony Shetty, oh, Tony I can either. take pictures of my food in here. I'm fucking <clears> pot <throat> noodle, like 85p. You know what I mean? No, because I went <laughs> now I went to Toronto <laughs> for a few days, you see. So uh yeah. oh, right, okay. Uh, Sorry. this one okay, and this next last uh, next one, Tony. Yep, yeah, they're shish kebabs, and they were two hundred and fifty lek each, which in English money um, is about uh, one ninety. And which which football club were they from, Tony? <laughs> it's not a football club. That was from a pub. 
This is football food. Surely. Sorry, two pounds ten each they were, sorry. Two pound yeah. ten each they were, but that wasn't a point. Tony, yet. Tony, Tony, you know how much I love you, right? But you've missed the mark on this. This is football food, isn't it? You know, well, it doesn't food. always have to be, but it's good. But uh, Tony had a shame. Tony had a shame. Oh, disease, well, so yeah. I had to put them He is a wheat a bix. You know what I mean? Uh, well, but what about this final one? Because Ian, if you, I don't think you would turn this one down here, oh, yeah. which I'll get up. Here's a bowl of couscous. It fucking cost us fucking next to nothing. <laughs> really not that nice. <laughs> <laughs> right, here's the last one then. Tony, what about this? Yeah. Um, <clears throat> don't forget these. Don't forget these. Tony, here's a packet of lentil crisps. You know what I mean? <laughs> What's the fucking point of that? <laughs> I love you, Tony, but your contributions have been <clears throat> fucking shit tonight. <laughs> no, it hasn't been shit. <laughs> Absolute shade. Oh, <laughs> that that was low carb being in beer at seventy eight pence a He's bottle. He's back. Mason's back. Hey, is he? Hi, Mason. Hey, hey, how are you yes. Yeah. Oh, are you uh, by the way, sorry. Mason, are you doing yeah. okay? Mason, I thought I'd come on. I thought. Give me a big yeah. fucking puddle, you big fucking horrible big fucking unit of a man. Yeah. Also, Scotland. Yeah, I'm going to Mason, I'll tell you what. Mason, all, right, no problem. No problem Mason, all you need to do is pick up anything that could be edible. Anything. Well, I'm just going to let uh, and Chippers. And it's, oh, it's going to be better than what <laughs> fucking Tony's just put on there. <laughs> Right, then um, I better get through these fun. comments. Absolutely. Nah, I just want to see. Barbara cool. back. It's oh, it's 4 0 to Holland now. I'm back. Hey, you saw it, Barbara? I saw it myself every time. Jesus, I'm probably not. Uh, what did you me. think of those uh, food picks, Barbara? I spent the whole time trying to fucking get to see Morgan again. I didn't see them. All right. Did you not? Barbara, all you need to say is Tony's were fucking shit. Pointless. <laughs> <laughs> Anyhow, Mason, what did you want to say? I'll come on since I feel a little bit better. And just to say thanks for all your messages, I do appreciate it. Anytime. No worries, uh... You too, mate. It's good Bucking to see you. Love you Mason. Mason, it's good to see you back again, man. And um, play, stay strong for us, man. Stay strong. <clears throat> and you know right what? Then. Make sure you reach out to anybody you want there. We're always there for you, my guy. Right then, I better get through these comments because I, I presume a lot of them are going to be a bit thingy. Chippers has a 10 gig worth of Louis picks on his Google Drive, all in his rest and thighs. <laughs> <laughs> oh, where's Lewis? No. Can Bruce score a man of the dude? Those are KFC chips. Looks dry than Katie after a night with chippers. People Bureau, think I wear tights. I don't even wear nice, tights. But that looks, poor. looks okay, but not for 10 quid. Vomit. Chicken and chips for a tenner. Get to fuck. Chippers is all stuff that's been <laughs> smacked by Homer Simpson. That's fine, but where the fuck's been? Where, who is Beer Viking? We Why? like to know, don't we? That's the stuff you're sh you shite when f fat in pills. Do they put cheeseburger in a mixer? That's Gary Glitter's crotch in a nick at Leeds. Oh. <laughs> Looks like Savile's had the shits from beyond the grave. Oh, Mason. Is that Chippers' prolapse? Hell no. Jeez, I... Oh, bloody hell, dear. Give me Savile. Oh, <laughs> no. At least he fixed it. Chippers will be straight to the box with that mushroom on a stick. Not a chance, as War Billy would say, fuck off. That's a great alien's <laughs> probe and cock. If it's not Steve <coughs> Bush to see, he's still trying to find his camel date. Archer wishes he was that size. Chippers has walked and past the boards. <laughs> what? No, Archer, do not prove any different. <laughs> Looks a bit dry, needs lube. Simon Jones, <coughs> Ego, no beer. Ooh, that's a caddy sausage, says Vic. No. <laughs> now, nah, rib off, no. That chili looks like the box Lewis keeps under his bed. That's the inside of Casey Price's fanny. Oh, looks like a That's crime. Disgusting. Oh, bloody hell, Ronald. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ. 
Give it all back. The factory where you sit down on it, 12.50 looks crap. One touch out with a board pull. Fuck up Brentford 2 d and nasty infections. That malnourished, isn't it? How oh, draw cog of the day. Ron Jeremy and side Katie Price. One touch Katie sides. Chippers would take every inch of that. Louis could wrestle and still lose. There's buzzing going on. Maybe it's oh, a cut rib of Arsenal. No. Arsenal's taking a piss. IKEA posting flat packs against says Mary. Uh-huh. <laughs> Fucking Arsenal wankers. That's dry than Harold Shipman's ball sack. I'm not being funny. I'm not being funny. Just looks to give out the one crap. The that's Viking, nice. Viking has to come on here. Which my biggest is Viking must be fucking absolutely thinking if we don't come on here because no. we're all fucking pig ugly. Mm-hmm. <laughs> we are sponsors runs are like having a bigger and team cook that big is the only time Chips is getting his beat between two flaps. That's more like exactly. mine hanging out. Burger looks dry as fuck. Steve Bruce is attempting to burger, <laughs> making a master chef. There you go, hamster burger. David Moyes is special mm-hmm. bacon cheese burger. I but not at that price. Doesn't look nice. No, uh, Katie Price is hysterical. Oh, <laughs> Katsuma's um, cat is. Oh, bloody hell! Oh. <laughs> Looks like Paul Galant. He, he got meal. a sponsor. <laughs> Katsuma got a sponsor. Just and he was sponsored by football take. Rishi Sunak's yeah, toilet I'm bowl. Yeah. Uh, the leftovers of Delia Smith's kitchen, says Mary. De- Decker's Mary, vomit. Mary? Let's get Mary on. Curry sauce went off. That's an axiom riddle. Cox, someone had a run on, had a fun on a period before getting infected. <laughs> oh, bloody hell, oh. Bia. <laughs> <laughs> Timmy oh, <laughs> usually oh. just spits on sausage that size. This is uh, Luke Chadwick five. Yes, Neil McDonald at the two. Looks like Luke Chadwick. Put the Luke Chadwick board back on. Anyway. Yeah, well, I've had Luke Chadwick comments before. Luke Inflamed roll kill. No Tony Pepperoni. No chippers would bone that pie. Yeah, to go for that. Shiting the pie with gravy. Steak and black pudding and Bob Rely. Hell no, no to that. Yes, but not a five and all. Scotch pies are beautiful, says Tom. Oh, pubes fright, says Mary. Yes, Mary. Oh, be a man. Oh, oh man. No. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, fuck's oh, sake. Fucking oh, disgusting. Looks like me cat, looks like me food, me cat used to chew and sick up. <laughs> looks like one of Chip's oh. fragmented stews, black pun. No, can we, can we, room. wait a minute, Pete, can we skip on to when fucking Tony put his bullshit on? We'll get, I'm getting to the comments. Let's get rid of these. Is John working as a tour guy for Joe Biden? Says Peter. <laughs> Be reading a bun, yes. I did. Our kids get shot once at school, but at least he saved a couple of quid on a bit. Yes to the chicken tikka. List. Oh, bloody hell, Joe. Oh, no. Uvis can't be the finish still here. It looks like Louis ring piece after you've just been seen to by Andre oh. the Giant. Louis, I'm telling you now. Pause, pause these there. Pause these there. Louis, I've, I've, I've met another, another, he's a big fucker, this lad as well. Um, I can't tell you how I know him, but he's, he's, a, he is actually a professional wrestler and I think he knows you. And What's he lives name? in, Wy- he lives in Wickham. I, I can't, I can't say. On, uh, lad, on I'll speak the toilet. <laughs> no problem. No, no. He's a big bastard and he lives in Wickham. And I think he knows right. you. Dick, Dick, Lane of Blood. I know him or why I know him. Uh, Chip has his cog when we, when we, that's when we go out Put it in the oh, private yeah. chat. Yeah. Put it in the private chat. Yeah. Some say Savalite, hi, Mason. Who angered the big red giant? Had Chopper. Is that is that giant sausage from Bristol? No, it wasn't. That's mighty. Katie Price reckons long and thing wiggles within. No, it's not there. I think it's only granny funny. Well, it looks like Chip is cock when he's had too much. Looks like rocket booster. <laughs> ten inches. No chance. Not very appetizing at all. Dries and nuns. Chuff will be like eating sawdust. <laughs> Sod off chicken nuggets. No irony. I mean, nope. Nine quid had a way in shite. You get more than a happy meal and Mackie D's for a third of a price. Yes, not bad. Fresh from the Guagmire. Chip is as after after it's been fisted by your <laughs> <laughs> why, why does why does that? 
Why does Archie get it all done? Now, Bobby Katzen, shake the ball. That's a stuss in North Lane queue. Right, Cliff and Anders and Rashford in a blander. Jimmy Somerville's also after a good night. Who's got their other halves vibrating love eggs on the side? <laughs> <laughs> oh, you just spat out! <laughs> <laughs> you just spit out there, Ian! Mary just needs me to make this joke with <laughs> no chance looks crap. No, John's phone interference while he's browsing grinder. Oh, oh. looks like Jim is the second continent of course. After curry night, John chips. No, does it look good? No, but so far, best up to now. Chicken curry and chips. No, Steve Bruce's stomach after a trip to Sunland. The ain't berries their chip is as anal beats. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Where's Chip has gone? He's went off. Back where he's in Maggot's way. I Louis ass after he joined Fink McMahon special. Club. Oh, <laughs> no. watch the season <laughs> on me. Not even sweet. That looks nice. Yeah, devil. Three pound of Rochdale on the way to Man City. Yes, you were saying that, Tom. I forgot to put that on. Three eighty a bargain. Yes, Kim <sighs> and the Frogs come on Chippers. As... Oh. <laughs> Jesus, all over that for three quid. And Whippy sells whiz for nearly 12 quid. Hulk Snight after of love after the night Steve Bruce left Newcastle. It was class pie, yes. Uh, good evening, Sam. Hope you're well. Big up, Sam. Big up. Good evening, Sam, from a team review. I'll be your pizza. Does it look bad quality? Yes, yes to pizza. Wow, nice. Is Papa, Papa Pickles, is... is Papa Pickles Sam? Yeah, that's yeah, Sam. Oh, Hi. So Papa Pickle, Sam said hello to me in the chat before. I didn't even know who it was. And I oh. just said hello back. I didn't even know that was Sam. Or Someone's pitch our party all fitted out the middle. That's how I you know said hello Albanian. to her anyway, didn't I? You know, Sam, so anyway. Yeah, maybe an Albanian gangster. Yes, Tony, I've had <sighs> Albanian pizza. <laughs> and they said, you're good, mates. Oh, Jesus, be a man. No. <laughs> Oh, 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 great. Jesus Christ. Well, it was she scabbed. One pound not made the adult. Two quid for that bargain on the pork she scabbed. I whispers on that one. A wheat of basis. It's like to say you've improved TDR. No heads up, but don't tell Paul. <clears throat> No to lentil crisps. No, it's a lentil. No yeah, no to lentil crisps. Hey, uh, cheers, Ian. That's very kind between us, Mason. Hey, uh, people, welcome Mason back in the chat. Ooh. As well, <laughs> lentil crisps and post bastards. Hey. Lentil crisps, Sainsbury shopper. Yeah, people saying we love you, Mason. Oh, yeah, lentil crisps. Wait a minute. Uh, I only fucking got them in because Tony That's brought it. loads of shit in. No one's fucking slagged any of Tony's shit off. You know what I mean? No, because the food's good, that's why. That food is not football food. Come on, Tony. <laughs> Doesn't have to be. It has to be football. Dogs, cocks in football grounds. Pete asked, <laughs> or... if, he could, he asked if he could put them on, and I said yes, of course. Yeah, there you go. Anyway, Bob. Peter. Peter. Anyway, anyway, Barbara. Peter, uh, Peter. Yeah. did you? Yes, I was given permission. <laughs> this is an absolute <laughs> disgrace. Hey. <laughs> I have had I have put football food on before. I've shared that before. I yeah, do apologize, yes. Tony. I do apologize for Peter breaking his own rules. I, I just thought, I just yeah, thought when was... I, and when I'm at Luton tomorrow, I'll see what the food's like. And if there's anything nice I'm gonna have, I'll make sure I'll take a picture of it. And hey, the there you go. Off. Yeah, yep. Uh Tony, anyway, Tony, Tony at the football. At the football because I had a had an email from Luton Town tonight because I've got a fact that apparently they're doing a fan in the ring tomorrow. So. Tony, me and you are friends, but otherwise we're going to fall out. <laughs> <laughs> uh, anyways, Barbara. Uh, yeah, there you go. Oh, okay. Anyway, Barbara, um, spent <coughs> Botman out for up to nine months. Yeah, shock, isn't it? Well, it's not really a shock as it happened so much this year, but it's terrible. It's, it's, it's like. Um, Canali thing all over again, living for six months, nine months, like just the pits. I mean, do, do you think he should have had the surgery earlier? Of course, he could, of course, he should have. Yeah, yeah, he should have. Of course, he should. Because they've got anyone be waiting another four months, then, like, 
Instead of having to wait nine. Who's blasting music? John. John's not me, me. Sorry. Not me. That's not you, John. It's all right. It was me. Sorry. Malcolm. Copyright. Where uh, is he? Doesn't matter. Uh, Sab says, uh, <laughs> he says, hey, uh, uh, Sab says to you, uh, Tony, it, food picks were too far high quality for this show. We want to see cat sick. Oh. oh. <laughs> Sorry, Sam. No, no, Sam. No, no, Sam. <clears throat> oh, well, that's for you, uh, Louis, that uh, Ian's put in the private uh, chat. Oh, that's all right. He's a big, big unit. I think, John. Hello, who you mean? Oh, yeah. The John's just put yeah, double link to Tony's channel. And mine as well. Yeah, he's put Tony. Yeah, go ahead. Yeah, that's fine. It's John, right. that, John's channel. Uh, well. Mama, Mama Flossie, me mod, would do the same as well. So if I told her, she'd do the same. She does yeah. it on um, tours as well, so I don't mind. So there you go. Yeah. Uh, anyways, yeah. Oh, and um. Did we mention earlier Leicester start legal proceedings against the Premier League and EFL because obviously, you know, they're under a transfer embargo now and potentially they could be getting a point deduction if they get promoted. Oh, that's all being Tony. What do you make of it? Ridiculous. Leicester, this PSA or oh, needs get rid of it. It's it's getting beyond the joke now. And do you know what it is, right? The way this <clears throat> is going, eventually, and and it's not just going to be me, but there's going to be a lot of fans thinking exactly the same. If this carries on the way it is now, a lot of fans, including myself, are just going to say, do you know what? What's the point in watching football? What's the point in football anymore? Because it's Tony, not enjoyable Tony, now. Because football should be football should year. be competitive. <laughs> football wow. should be competitive. And I'm sorry, they say the Premier League's the most competitive league in the world. That's a load of crap because it's competitive for the top six only. The rest of the the rest of the fourteen clubs, they don't give a shit about the fourteen clubs. Richard yeah, Masters yeah. does not give a crap. That man or, does not give or a crap. in your words, Tony, tricky dicky. Tricky dicky as I call him. Exactly, because that's exactly what he is. And even them fuckers are getting fucked now. Let's mm -hmm. Even Let's they're getting fucked. Stay can't spend any money. Do you know what we've got? We've got the greatest. We the Premier League is the best, the the elite football league in the world. And suddenly, because they brought in these fucking stupid, unthought of rules, rules that they haven't thought out properly because they couldn't fucking kick their own asses if they fucking had a foot on their asshole. They are the fucking the so stupid. They're so stupid. They can't actually understand. That what they've done is they've brought in rules to stop teams outside of the top six being able to spend yeah. money. I think what they've actually good. done is they've, yeah. what they've actually done is they've actually stopped the teams that produce that that, that spend more money also spending money. So then Man United can't spend any money. Yeah. Man City have got 115 charges. Tottenham are under scrutiny. Everyone's under scrutiny. No one can spend any money. So they, they, where are these players going to go? They're going to go to Spain. They're going to go Germany. They're going to go wherever. The Premier League that, is, eat, eat, is eating itself from the inside. It's not I'm about trying. football anymore. Exactly, Ian. I totally agree. This this was my argument. I mean, a lot of, like you say, you know, how are we going to bring the top players at this league? Because eventually they're just going to say, well, there's no no point in going there because they're not that competitive. The They'll go now. elsewhere. I mean, I don't mean to shout over you, but this is one thing I've tried fucking saying on so many forums, forums sorry, and I've never gone it over. I'm going to say it on Pete's. Do you know what I'm, the, the actual truth of this? You, you know, we've got players now who are playing with injuries, right? Players who, like Botman, who've played with an injury. You know, when you look at it, players like Sean, who's playing with an injury. All these players who've played with injuries, they're playing with injuries because we have we can't afford to sign anybody as a backup player of any quality. So their fucking rules blocking us signing players is actually injuring players and and, and make it and, and, and actually like, like actually crucifying players' careers. 
Yeah. Of course it is. Yeah, of course. That's I mean, the fucking what... truth. And nobody, no fucker said that. And I tried saying it on another forum and I, and I didn't manage to get it out because I think I was too pissed or whatever. But that is the truth. I've looked. No, I'm you, not, not you fucking pissed. looking at it. I know. Like, yeah, I, I fucking looked at this and I've just looked at it and I've gone, right. He would not be playing if he, they are so committed to our club. Right, Sean Longstaff is so committed to Newcastle. Everyone's fucking slating Longstaff because he's been shit. Yes, he's been shit because he can't run because he's having injections in his foot. He can't feel his foot. He's I'm got sick of this foot. injection bollocks now. Yeah, it's not a bollocks, yeah. Agreed, just no bollocks. Fucking... He's injured. He's injured. He's injured. Wait, yeah, when he's dropped, like, 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 it's, it's the truth. You look, you look now, Botman. Botman was injured last year. Yep. Botman didn't want, Botman said himself, he didn't want to have an operation because he loves the club and he loves the team. And he's, it's, he should know a bit better, though. That's the thing, eh, Ian. He should know a bit better. He should know a bit better. But I'll tell you what, you know, if you were asked to fight for your family, what would you do? The yeah. fact is, if you knew your family have no one to, re like, so, so it's your, so say it's your podcast, Pete. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And there's no fucker who's going to, there's no mason who's going to come in here and step in for you. So your podcast fucked. What would you mm -hmm. do? You'd well, carry on. Yeah. You'd carry yeah. on. And that's all he's done. And that's what mm -hmm. he's fucking done. And these people are making these kids, these lads, these young 23 year old, 22 year old, 21 year old, 25 year old, whatever. They're making those players play through injuries. Because we can't fucking sign any players because we've got no money to sign these players. They're injuring young kids. They're destroying their careers because, for only one reason, because they're fucking protecting the big six. And even the big fucking greedy six aren't being protected. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Like, and that's what I was trying to get across the other night on another forum, but yeah. I couldn't. You know, you know what it is, right? I mean, Toys made a good point, right? Mm -hmm. That um, what's the point of going to a football match if we cannot compete, right? I mean, I think he said as well that Antwerp is taking UA for on. Yeah. This mm -hmm. could be another, and I'm gonna say this now, this could be another bossman. Do you remember what bossman? No, it's yeah, no, John, you're fucking right. This is a bigger bossman. This is bigger than bossman. This is bigger than bossman, Ian. Because the yeah. end of the day, right, if Angle's going to do this, take him on, go for it, go for it. Because, do you know right? why? I hope, they win. I, hope they win. I hope they win. I hope they win. Sorry, and I hope they win because <coughs> at the end of the day, this is going to get worse than Bosman. This is not going to end because the clubs now has had an F enough, right, telling what we can spend, what we can't spend. Tom spot on, by the way, when he said that United's in billions in debt, they can spend. Chelsea spent a billion, they can carry on, yeah? But we can spend, but can I spend? What the Premier League's trying to tell us now is like, sell your best players to the top six because yeah. they've got, they got a super league. Yeah. They've got a super league. They've got a super league. That's what they got, a super league. Yeah? Yeah, and absolutely, we, John. 14, right? I'm absolutely furious on this, right? That for the Premier League, <laughs> UEFA needs to wake the echo up right now and just say, right, you know what? This ain't working. This is why January has been a dead window. It's been a dead window. This is what's going to be said, basically. Basically, wrong, what's going to be wrong said right, is... Wrong or right? What's going to be said is... Go on, then. Right. It's a... It, it, the, in, what, in what world? Like, you know, some of us, we work for people, our bad businesses, whatever, right? We have a, a few businesses in the past, yeah? In what world... Can you not set a business up mm. and spend your money to build yeah, a business? Crazy, yeah. yeah, it's crazy. Crazy, it's yeah. Absolutely absolutely this is, this is the only it's business. It's anti-competitive. And all these, these, these rules that were, you know, it's so transparent. Like, they were brought in so that, to, you know, fuck me, Leicester. Sorry for swearing. Leicester. Leicester in the championship. They're going to come up. When they come up, they're going to have a minus four or minus six deficit. It's yeah. fucking bollocks. Ian, it is. What do they want to do? What do they want to do? What do they want to do? It's right? competitive, and it's actually against, like, it's against our fucking laws of forget football. Football's right. a, football <laughs> is a game. Yeah, it is. It's, 
business is a fucking business. Fuck these cunts. Fuck them. And if I was if I was in charge of Newcastle, I would just go. My lawyers are better than yours because fucking trust me, they are. We are fucking so much richer than these cunts. Do we will is, fucking so. bend them over and do them up the shitter, right? Yeah. We will just go. Okay, your lawyers argue with our, our lawyers, and that's yep. what it's going to come to in the end. But what I think, what I think Newcastle are doing is playing it really cleverly and going. I'm not going to be a psycho. Pathic as fucking two trader. What we're going to do is sit back and let these other people do that, and then right at the end we might join in. You know what I mean? Yeah, absolutely, uh, Ian. Uh, Mary yeah, says, "How many Jacksons have players out before getting injured? Too many." So I counted about a thousand. Too many words there. I mean, the thing <laughs> is, right with it, with all this carry on with this PSR and all this. I mean, yes, they're trying to protect clubs from not going in. Mm-hmm. Administration, but <clears throat> with clubs like Forest, of, like Forest came up last season, they had players out of contract who left the club. They had players who are unknown left the club, so they had to spend money to get to to be able to buy a team and stay and compete in the Premier League. Now, because they've done that, and because Brennan Johnson was sold three weeks after the deadline, after the accounts deadline, they're now done the four points because of this and after, yep. they've got every right to be aggrieved and the thing is they talk about not putting clubs in trouble but if clubs are coming up from the championship and they're competing to try and stay in the Premier League and I bet you now the likes of Luton Town and teams like that when they've come up they're probably thinking oh we don't want to spend too much money because we're frightened in case we get a points deduction so they're not spending a lot of money so that squads aren't strong enough and then they're going straight back down again. How is that helping a football club? That is not helping a football club. That is telling the football club, you know, you can come up and have your season up here, but you can go straight back down because if you want to overspend, do it, but you'll be hit with a point deduction. The thing is, Sony, honestly, it's not going to last anyway because it's now it's already affecting the bigger clubs, the likes of City, 115 charges, whatever that is now. You know, like at some point, like, like let's be honest. Everton had what three or four charges against them. The reason that well, Everton got, the, yeah, I, I, I'll be honest, I fucking hate Everton. I, I, I cannot stand Everton. But Everton got, Everton got done, right? And then it got reduced, and they got whatever they got, six or four points, whatever it was. Four, they ended four up points with. now, yeah, four, yep. six, right? But then two. the reason, no, but then the reason that City I'm back to six. Is it? Yeah, they got reduced from ten to six. Yeah, yeah. They got six, right? They got six. The reason, the reason City haven't been done is because they say, "Well, there's so many charges against them. We, you know, we we couldn't possibly do it very quickly." Well, pick the fucking six that you know that are fucking bad that you've definitely got them on. No, pick pick one that you've got them on. Because you've just, however much I hate Everton, and I do, the Scouse Mackhams, pricks, wankers, fucking wankers, absolute bunch of pricks. The coppers are pricks there, the stadium <laughs> shit, the fans are wankers. You get the message. The, you, know, not, not like the, the, you know, the whole the whole thing, the only good thing that's come out of Everton is fucking our player, Anthony Gordon. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, <laughs> like, but, but, but let's be honest, They've got stitched right up. Leicester are getting stitched up. Fucking Knott's Forest are getting stitched up. There's yes, another club as well is going to get stitched is- up as well. I don't know that club is. I wouldn't that club is Leeds. They could be mm-hmm. stitched up as well. Everton, their, their second hearing is now being heard on from Monday. So they will... So they reckon there's going to be another six-point deduction coming their way. So that'll be before the end of this... Well, they reckon Forest, that's our next week. It's a three-day here and starting yeah. Monday, and then they reckon it'll be a week after when the um, points deduction, when the announcement comes out, that'll be deducted a further six points, they reckon. That'll put them in the relegation zone. Oh, great. They'll who, play who, br- brilliantly just in time to play Everton. off. Yeah. Who's on? Everton. Everton. <laughs> oh, great. 
and then they're still waiting for that takeover from 777 partners to be um, rubber stamped. And I'll tell Apparently, you now, if that gets rubber stamped, they're in the they're in deep shit, everything. They really yeah. will be. Because well, apparently they're, Isaac, they're, they're, they're they were they owned Donald the Asian Isaac Hayden got uh, paid back from his loan there because they weren't paying him. Yeah, he's taking them to court, isn't he? Right. Yeah. When, when you when you look at the fit and proper fucking, uh, it's a joke. Seven that seven are awful loaners. Yeah. They are like, oh, who went there? Oh, it's John. 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 Oh, John's gone there. So anyway, but well, anyway, yeah. we went from brought in brought sausages to that. But no, I'm, I'm telling you now, it's something that, like, for me, needs to be talked about more and like, like and, and screamed about. And this is our game. These these are fucking idiots that are running our game. Blazers, pricks. They know nothing about football. Bunch of fucking wankers, and I and I I couldn't give two fucks if anyone comes and says to me, "Oh, you've like libeled us." Fuck off! Don't give a fuck, you fucking nonsies, fucking dickheads. Fuck off. That's my thought on it. Who <laughs> fought it? That's it, Granny. Well, who fought it? What could you get out of the background? I couldn't you hear anything. Archer, Archer, you did. Oh, it, it wasn't you, that. Archer, was it? I did fall, and I. Oh, fuck <laughs> <me>. oh. <laughs> oh Archer, this is cool. Anyway, well then, we'll come to the end of the show now. So, oh, that's gone over too quickly, in my opinion. So, we'll um, score prediction for the England game tomorrow. I suppose so. God, I'll start oh. with you, Louis. Two two. Okay then. Anyway, see you, Louis. See you, Louis. See you, Louis. See you, See you, Louis. Louis. See you, 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 and the last is an L. Tom, Tom Lynch. Oh, I didn't get the Archer scores. Out of the second. Oh, it went. It was gone. Oh, Louis's <laughs> gone. Uh, go on, uh, get Lawrence back in. You'll score for the ladies uh, for Saturday, for tomorrow, Lawrence. I'll say 3 1 to Newcastle. Oh, interesting. Okay. Uh, yeah, Lawrence. Who the fuck was that? That's disgusting. Yes. <laughs> yes, exactly. Uh, again, back to you, Archer. She said 3 1 in the score for the women's. Uh, for the women's, all gone. Who are they playing like? Hashtag United. Is that in the final? It's a final. That's gone 5 0. Oh, wow. <laughs> Interesting. Uh, Ian. 7 0 for the ladies. Oh, and for England. Depends who's playing. <clears throat> England. I, and... I, I think two all, realistically, but I hope we do. I hope we beat them. But two all. No oh, problem. Okay, cheers, Ian. Good to see nice you. Nice one, Mason. Thank you, Mason. 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 Ian. Mason. Oh, love you, man. You know, I love, I love you. you. <laughs> Come and give us a big hug next time I see you, a big fucking cuddly little bastard, fucking lovely fucker. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and the rest is as well. Yeah, Fuck yeah, off, yeah. everyone. Yeah. Fuck yeah. off. Yeah. Just, just <laughs> being <laughs> <obvious>. yeah. <laughs> Good to see you. Love you, man. Love you, man. Uh, Barbara. Four nil for the ladies. Oh, nice one. And the England score? And, uh, oh. say Brazil, Brazil will win 2-1. Oh, interesting. Well, cheers, Barbara, for coming on. First time on the channel. I hope we'll see you yeah, again on very it was soon. A, it, was a, it was a trail. Did I hear me funny voice, Nicholas? 
No, oh, no, it's fine. They, they, they can happen, but that, uh, that, hopefully. Now, is that back to me now, my boys? No way. Uh, yeah, I think Brazil will win the game. Like, they're you, they? no but, um, so it's great to be great to be on the show, John. Thanks yeah, for I don't Peter, Peter, and it's great to see John again. Yeah, hopefully we'll see you again, Barbara. Barbara. Yeah, Barbara. 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 Um, but the last is, um, it's going to be historic for us. I'm going to go, oh, I see goals in this one. 2-1 to Newcastle. And, um, but the lads, I'm going to say, um, this is not a good Brazil team, by the way. They've got players out as well. So, I'm going to say three, ooh, it's going to be goals. 3-1 to England. Oh, interesting. Okay, then. Well, I'll drop you backstage, John, if you want to have a chat backstage. Yeah, 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 yeah. Thing. I'll stay on. I'll stay a little bit, I. Uh, Tony, yeah, uh, England three, Brazil one. Um, and I think the lasses will win four nil tomorrow. Oh, wow, Tony! I, think, wow. I, th- I mean, look, hashtag United are second in their league. Um, you know, behind Portsmouth, we did beat Portsmouth at St James's Park 2 1. Um, look, the women did well last week, they were 2 0 down. Uh, Becky Langley showed Eddie how how you get how you are reactive towards a game, and she showed them how proactive she was because she put the subs on at half time, and they won the game three two. So look, um, I, I think I think um, Newcastle win this tomorrow. I think the lasses are on a on a roll at the moment, and uh, look, it's great because the women's team has just gone to another level since the owners are coming. You know, the former owner couldn't give a shit about them, didn't even have oh. strips for them. But at least these owners are doing everything for them. And look where we are now. Cusp of the championship, which means if we get through the championship, we're in the Premier, the Super League. So we could be in the Super League in a couple of seasons. And, uh, you know, it, it, it's just going to be absolutely fantastic. So, look, I think it'll be great tomorrow. I'll be doing vlogs on there. I'll try and do a live if I can. So do keep oh, an eye nice for that, one, guys, tomorrow. Nice one, Tony. Um, and it is on BBC iPlayer as well tomorrow. So it is live, yeah. half past two kickoff. No problem. Well, I'm just hoping to the... be back home in time for the game. Oh, well, game. Well, just... well, no problem. I'll just drop you in the background, Tony. And thanks Cheers. for coming on tonight. You know, yeah, you too. Great to see Mason again. There you go. Well, then, guys. Uh, we're going to wrap up there. Good good to see you, Mason, coming on for the last part of the show. So, there you are. Some good ah, for oh, England wins. Sure Someone's going for Brazil wins. Come on, last is for the double. Bad hangover tomorrow for you. Two trader. It's a pattern sound. It's stopped now. 4 0 um, as well. So, there you are. Well, then, guys, if you have enjoyed uh, tonight's show, and can I just say, post... okay. go on, Mason. Can I just say, the people, the people doubted about the South Wales derby. Look at you. There you are. Anyway, Lovely, if you have enjoyed, if you have enjoyed tonight, show, hit the thumbs up. It keeps us up those search results. Please, of course, if you're brand new to the channel, if you're not yet subscribed and you enjoy what goes on the channel week in week out, hit that subscribe button. Free to do so to help me the channel grow. And hit the bell notification that will let you know whenever we are live, and when there's a pre-recorded video takes place on the day as well. As well, and feel free to donate and if you want to become a member for just 99p, just hit the join button, you'll be put to the next prize draw we do on this channel as well. Well, until we'll let you know when the next show takes place as well. So until then, everyone, we'll see us all later. I'll just die for these last comments. Goodbye, Covey, dear chaps, just bye, Peter Mason, and you as well, Judy. Well, until next show, guys, we'll see us all later. Take care, everyone. And we're the lads and lasses. See you all later, guys. Take care. Trust me.